Okay. So sorry about that, guys. There was a technical difficulty, or, or otherwise known as a bad wire. There's nobody but, on. What's that? There's nobody on yet. Well, but they're gonna come on. Okay. They'll be here. I, I know. I know they will. I have faith in them. While you were gone, we had to we installed it and ran. Yeah. Yeah. And now we're <laughs> taking it back. Yeah. yeah. Freshening it up now. Yeah. It's, we actually wore it out. It ran a lot. Now we're redoing yeah. the valve. <laughs> Anybody on yet? 31 people. 31 people! Wow. What's up, everybody? One of the finest people the Earth has ever known. Now they can get a, a close up of, of Andy mm -hmm. setting the, the, the lash. Get a, get a tight close up on Andy. No, no, it's fake. You, you see the faces? Yeah, it's, yeah. <laughs> okay. How's the picture, guys? So what Andy is using here is a tool specifically made to set valve lash on a 426 Hemi. Do you want to show them? Yeah. So the nice part of this tool is you have a 9 mm -hmm. socket, and basically inside of it is a screwdriver head. So the screwdriver head obviously sits in the slot for the ball adjuster on the rocker. And the 916 socket is obviously for the locking nut. So instead of having a wrench and a screwdriver and when you go to tighten and you go to do this and that, this kind of combines it into a wrench and then this big knob that can adjust the lash on the push rod. And then this cross was put in here to know basically if you're holding it straight up and down or if you need to go 90 or what have you. So overall, and then we're setting it intakes at 18 and exhaust at 20. So I got my 20 feeler gauge not going in right now. So I line up my screwdriver blade, loosen up the lock nut. Got my 20 thousandths feeler gauge, not going in yet. Loosen up the adjuster here. 20 goes in, tightening it down. 20's, that sounds good. 20's tight. Hold the big knob and just bring the locking nut down. That's an ingenious that little tool. Locking nuts down. You just impressed the whole room with that, man. And we got a tight 20 thousandths. Well, mine doesn't. That seems like it's really tight. Can I see what your 20 feels like? Yeah, your 20 is. Your 20 is like 16. 18. <laughs> well, we can easily adjust it. My poly doesn't even have lock nuts. You just get on there with a wrench. But that, but you see, that's the thing about yeah. setting lash. So we get right? on here. Yeah. Yeah. Just, just, just open up. Just, just that. break that. Turn that a hair. Tighten her back. Let's try see. that. Everybody has a different. Yeah. That's, that's tip. Feel that. That's twenty. <laughs> here. But this tool makes it nice and easy. It does. To break the lock nuts. Everybody has a different feel for what, for what it actually is. Okay, I think we got a rough lash on all the valves. Woo wee! Making progress. All right, so what's the next step? What are you gonna do? All right, next up. Intake manifold. We got intake. We can. Uh, yeah, I think intake. So you want to talk about these being not used on? These are only used in 1966. So on a, on a wedge motor, these are where the valley pan bolts up. You have these, these strips that, that sandwich here. But on a 426 Hemi, there is no valley pan like you have on a, uh, on a wedge motor. Instead, the intake manifold covers the whole thing. 
that in 1966, only 1966, they used these. But evidently there was an issue with them cracking the corners of the manifold because these are the, these are odd angles. The expansion is is different. Is it a computer? So they did away with these in '67. Yep. They stopped using them as uh, was putting fasteners on. Them. Right. Right. They don't went to dowels. They went to dowels. So what's interesting is you can get three different types of gaskets. We have these. We have these, and you have these. Right. So, so these would be '66 only. Right, or if you wanted to use a dowel, these you use with a blown application. Sure. And those are the ones we would use on a street motor. Do most people just use RTV on those? What? Well, well, these go in yeah. after you put you gotta put these these gaskets yeah. on first. Yeah. Um, just interesting how they have the points on there still. So. Well, those those like points it. fit into. Oh, okay. This is the wrong cable. Well, then use these. I got the right cable in the truck, maybe. It's still long. It is long. Unless there's a front and the back. Well, that's, a, that's an odd sign, isn't it? That's a little bit of an odd sign. Okay. Trim to length. <laughs> no. That, uh, well, that's the, that's the right one. Trash metal says, "Uh oh, it's been decked." <laughs> I was mean, just thinking this <laughs> trash go. metal. I don't think that that would matter on the release. Where's the intake manifold? Pop that on there. Get it. You can use my side. side. Let's get a gasket in there. Where, where are they? Where, 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 where. Can't lay a bead of silicone all the way across like a Chevy? No. No. No, Eugene. It's on backwards. No, it's on, it's on right. Can you put them on backwards? Oh, you probably could, yeah. Well, what about the cutout for the suit? Oh, it's on the front. It's right, the big one. This is the coil mount right here. Oh, yeah. Alright, here. Here. Is there anything? They're saying put the intake gaskets on. Alright, what do you want to do there? Just lift it straight up. Go ahead and take that gasket. Hold it right there in the corner, that's what you're saying, like I am. Outside. Yeah. I guess, I guess no, here. You, no, you can't have your finger there. Good. You're saying the cork will squish a little. I bet it's fine. It's cute. No, you lift up on your side. Battery charging. I think the gas Thank can you. just drop a little bit. Get sucked in. Yeah, on my side, it's good. Yeah, no, you, you got to come up on your side. Here, see how I'm holding the gas? See how I'm holding the gasket? Right yeah. there, outside. Yeah, okay. Okay. That looks good. Yep. And that looks good. Yeah, perfect. Okay. It's not been decked. I was panicking for a second. I didn't think this. Say it again, Timmy. <laughs> it has <laughs> not been decked. There's a gap right here. But yeah. Well, we have the gas gas. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So on this, I use the blue, the yellow weather strip. I use. That's the best thing to put on there. What's up, zero? If you remove that. It's like watching government workers dig a hole. <laughs> Is that nice, Ken? Well, I am a government worker. <laughs> I used to be. Government workers right here. I work in law, so does that count? <laughs> <laughs> I've been to some places. <clears throat> There's nothing quite like spending four hours sitting in an MP's office waiting for the clearance to come through so you can go on site. Yeah. Well, Campbell? Yeah. Uh, so it helps to own the MPs. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> this guy. Oh. <clears throat> Where's the cam? <laughs> oh, shit, we forgot the oh, cam shaft. the cam's oh, not in it. Put all that stuff on there, did the head, no oh. cam. Come we on, already ran it. Was we haven't settled our, our issue on the bottom. Which issue on the bottom gas? Well, well, these have to be put in place first. Are they holes or no holes? These go first. Right. Everybody's like, giddy and excited. We're so close. Mm. Ah. Crap. This is all this stuff. You want to use the black? <laughs> use the black, we'll use this on. William says hats off to the owner of this motor. He is Army Vets, as I am too. Thank you for your service. Oh, there it is. He's being modest. Okay, he's a one-man war machine. Okay. Once upon a time. <laughs> he can invade a village with a hot dog bun. <laughs> <laughs> and take no prisoners. We well, there's three buns. hot dog buns and Murphy's Burn is about 10 miles that way. <laughs> What's up, Dirty Nubs? No, Alright, what do you numbers. want? Just on the... Uh, <laughs> just yeah. yeah. And still out in the corner? Not yet. All right, I just want to stick the gaskets in place. See, if this was, if this was a drag motor that you're going to take apart every run, you use the yellow other strip adhesive on this so it just stays. That won't stay. So you would have to re-glue it every time you took it apart. But hopefully this is only going together once. Inshallah. Mm, <laughs> Hipsters and Hippies says, I would use some painter's tape on the outside edges. Pull the table off. Pull the tape off on the edges as soon as I got a few bolts through to locate the gaskets correctly. Hmm. Uncle Tony, why don't you use the red tacky adhesive? Red tacky <laughs> adhesive? That's what he said. It's red call. Loctite, if that's what you mean. They don't use that on this. There is a red tacky instead of the yellow, I guess. Well, there's a weather strip adhesive. It What's comes up, black and yellow. And there's really no functional difference. I've just always used the yellow because it's habit. And on here, you almost have to use the yellow because it's the, oh, the, the weather screen adhesive because it's the only thing that guarantees this isn't moving out. Oh, he's saying, I think he means the spray can gasket. It comes out red. Oh, the spray tack. Yeah, 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 I guess you could use that, but this. It's called high tack, he said. High tack. Yeah. Hermitex high tack. Good copper coated. Yeah. Peanut butter, Big Bear says. <laughs> Don't get too in with it. Well, you got it in the port. Come on, is that what they teach you in the fucking army? Yeah. <laughs> they don't teach me 426 times in the army. What time is it over here? Oh, what time is it? It is. It's not showing on my phone. Three? Three, four? Three, four. Three forty-seven. Okay. <clears throat> It's 9.50 a.m. Sunday in New Zealand. Wow. 9.50 a.m. Uncle Big Bed will be 55 tomorrow. Yeah, I got a bad parallax here. Yeah. Well, Happy birthday my, tomorrow. My, my, you got it. You got it. It's Hemi time. It's Uncle Kathy's birthday every day. Every day every is my day. birthday. <laughs> That's right. How did you know? Is he listening in? So he must be listening in. Don't you remember? He said happy birthday once. He does it every day. And I said, day. oh, happy birthday. And he says, it's not really your birthday. Yeah, he tells me happy birthday every day. That, like, way, he, that way he can't forget. <laughs> Many times a day. And I say it back. Happy birthday. Sir. Well, everybody likes to have their birthday, right? Who doesn't like to have their birthday? No, that's the first thing we say to each other every right. day. So happy, happy birthday. birthday every day. Oh, so that's happy birthday, dude. Happy birthday. That's the trick to a happy marriage. Oh, so Tony, that way you never forget. It's working. Yeah. <laughs> so Tony, that's we haven't why killed each other yet. Years old. There's two secrets. Put your anniversary <laughs> in your wedding ring. Engrave it. You'll never forget it that way. Back in the day, I met a jeweler whose wife had somebody else engrave his wedding band for him. Had him do it. it just said, put it back on on the inside. 
Yeah, that's pretty good. <laughs> good advice, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> my, 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 my wife's boyfriend broke my jaw with a fence post. <laughs> <laughs> what? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> you, you, you never saw that commercial? No. Oh. You never saw that commercial? No. Get, 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 your, get your phone. Uh, my, Can we play that without it being a problem? Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. God. Yeah. My wife's boyfriend. I don't know what's going jaw. on here, guys. <laughs> yeah, my wife's boyfriend broke my, my jaw with a fence post. Good morning from Tasmania, Australia. Good oh. morning. I uh, got uh, mobile home commercial. Just mobile home. Oh, I know the one you're talking, you know talking about. Yeah, I see it. It's funny. <laughs> yeah. All right, Tony, what's next? You gotta pay attention to the motor so you don't mess up. Don't mess uh, up. I'm getting the kind of stuff you don't want to open at all, actually. Yeah, no, don't bring it <laughs> up. Oh yeah, like <laughs> No, that's not it. No. <laughs> what is it? I'm going with, going what the fuck are you finding? I just searched for this YouTube. That alcohol. must be because of the stuff he ghouls on a regular basis. Probably. That doesn't surprise me at all. Yeah, uh, uh, Coleman, Coleman Liquidators. You're doing the yellow? Oh, God. C U L L M A N Liquidator. <laughs> and why it. I remember this, I don't know. I don't uh, you got to trim. Okay, this this gets plugged Ow. right into the edge of this. It must sell. Best TV commercial ever. Okay. <laughs> That's probably it. <laughs> Epic. Oh, mobile home. Yeah, that's <laughs> a voucher in Birmingham hit How me in much? the face of the Crescent Bridge uh, five times, and my wife's boyfriend broke my jaw with a fence post. <laughs> so if you don't buy a trailer for me, you're not gonna, gonna hurt, hurt my, my feelings. feelings. <laughs> that's too much. That's too much. Because you gotta take it off both sides. Okay. Thank you, Chooch. Do the head bolts go into water jackets on a 426? Yes. Yes, they do, Chooch. Well, she should been on all day. Yeah. Um, take it off of, take it off of this side. Just the slightest here. Uh, Matthew says, hi, Tony. What are the specs for the Hemi, or is it just a stock build? <coughs> it's a little warmer than stock. It's basically the cam. It's got a, I think we went too far. What's that? I think I went too far. We That's okay. Mike says, I wouldn't use them cork china wall gaskets. I'd use silicone. It's too big of a gap for just silicone. No, that'll be fine. This will be fine. <laughs> Walther says, love follow you on TV. Greetings from Norway. Hello. My family's Norwegian from south east of Bergen. Good commercial, right? That's fucking great. You won't hurt my feelings if you don't buy one. Uh, is there anything we can help y'all do? Right now, no. We can go to the bar and you can finish up. <laughs> okay. What's up, the kicking down? That's a, that's a high <laughs> degree know, of yeah, trust. At, at, th no, at this point, we could probably get it done. Do you trust that? I wouldn't. I, yeah, I'm with you. Kicking Dell says to weld it. I, yeah, you would. Good idea. <laughs> Good afternoon, the formula. Tony, are you doing a good yeah. job? I'm messing with the fuel part. Uh, <laughs> the ignition part. Going nowhere. I'm doing nothing compared to this artistic. There's a reason companies oh, make gasket guys. Well, this company made the gasket a hair too long. Let <clears throat> okay. pull it over. What, is there somebody outside? I heard her door shut and people talking. Well, keep them away. <laughs> uh, let's see. Yeah, them cork gaskets always leak. Oops. I think when we put my poly together, we can RTV it. Well, but... aren't you fucking special? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're doing it wrong, Tony. Wait. No, no, wait, no. What was this? I, I was the the gap is too big. You can't it's do it anyway. Right. Yeah. He doesn't want this thing raining oil. All right, so now black. Fresh metal says, I think it was supposed to overlap each side and squish down to seal the corners. It's, no, it's, it's right up against the corners. 
We're going to do it now, though. They're coming yeah. for you, Barbara. I'm going to put it to the inside. Yeah. I guess the neighbor's working Actually, a little bit more. Van over there. That's it. Box truck. Yeah, that's it. You can put the glob to the inside so it can't get pushed out. That's it. Let's see. I remember putting the intake on a uh, Garrett's charger in the uh, advanced auto parking lot. Holy cow! Yeah. It's gonna leak dark. too many hands. <laughs> <laughs> Who's this fucking optimist? <laughs> Who's this optimistic person over I don't here? Know. <laughs> Each set of hands has admission. Tony should have been a surgeon. He's got sausage fingers. Yeah, he, he can't be a surgeon. Right, next? Let's drop that manifold on. I heard if we put this on backwards, it'll be better. It will. <laughs> yeah. That means you can put the coil wherever you want. Be careful. Straight down. There you go. Okay. That engine thing looks so cool. The engine thing? Yep. See, that's what I would have typed. Thingy. That engine thingy. thingy the engine so thingy. Cool. That's what Sabrina would say. Yep. All right, Mark, there's, um, in the book, I wrote hand wrote notes on no, different books. There's specific locations for all this crap. This is one big old motor. I didn't call it an elephant for no reason. Well, I know that, but, you know, it's a big old motor. See what Andy's in. Okay, so, they called this the elephant. What did they call the road? Hi, Bob. Nick in for it. Johnny, have a bottle. No, that's fine. This is the elephant. That's the picture, everybody. It's still good? All right, I got a trivia question. But I wrote bold. I got a trivia question. Okay, so they called the 426 Hemi the Elephant, right? What did they call the early Chrysler, the 331, 354, 392? So this is the Elephant. What's that called? Okay, good. They're saying that the picture looks good. Jeff. Jeff is close. Yeah. Brad. Now Brad is way out, but Herschel. Two medium stones. Partial to Hemi. Do I have to? Do I have to say it? No. Nobody yet. I know what it is. Scrambles. I know you know what it is. Scrambles the Death Dealer. No. Nobody. I have no idea. Swamp Rat. Brandon. Red Ram. Brandon. Mouse. Zebra. Most important thing right now is get two of them in there. Tony Mouse, Zebra. John Doe. The Muffin. The Muffin. <laughs> it's the Muffin. Freedom. Yes, much freedom. Fireball. Sparkles. Garrett. Right, forget it, forget it. It was called the Whale. Oh, the Whale. The, three, the 426 is called the Elephant. The 382 is called the Whale, right? But here's, here's the big trivia question, okay? Ah, I love this. I have to give something away for this. What do you got? Okay, uh, Sabrina. For this, for this thing I'm of ketchup. I'm not done eating burgers yeah. with that. Okay, for this thing of ketchup. Yeah. Mine is Kathy's oh, wait, for the burger. What? <laughs> Mine is my ketchup oh. for the burger. Just give away Sabrina. <laughs> Go ahead. No, I'm not, I, no, I keep her for myself. <laughs> I got a, I got a milk ketchup. All right, yeah, you're gonna. All right, so, so this is oh, the winner of this gets the ketchup. All right. Okay, we'll drop this in a in a, uh, a flat rate envelope. You have it. Eight dollars like, to send. Nine dollars to send ketchup. That's okay. right. You'll get your fucking ketchup. Okay, so, Alan, Kids are watching, Alan, Tony. Excuse my French, children. Stud. Okay, so they call the early Chrysler the whale. They call the late 426 the elephant. But why do they call it the elephant? Not sure. And where did that term originate from? Oh, this is gonna be a long answer. No, but it's a very it's a it's it's like okay, it's like a very good trivia question. Okay, Owen Gibson, thank you. Five Canadian. Thank you. Does decking the block and heads change the angle of the mating surfaces of okay, the intake? So yes, it does. First position. So Jeff was close. Yeah, followed by two bolts. Jeff is kind Jeff of was close. close. I mean, why really did they go with the stud? Yeah. Why do they call the 426 Hemi three bolts? Long intake runners? The elephant. No. No. 
Uh, valve covers? You're never going to get this. You Elephants are afraid of mice? Bingo, exactly. Aaron exactly. Hinkley really? won the ketchup. Yep. All right, Aaron you Hinkley, it. send yes. us your address yes. at <laughs> Uncle Tony's Garage at gmail.com. That's Uncle Tony's Garage at gmail.com. Elephant, yeah. And you will get ketchup in the mail. Elephant <laughs> is actually a derogatory <laughs> term. We've been eating the ketchup too, so. It's Elephant. brand new. I bought it today. We've only used it on eight hamburgers. It's lightly used ketchup. <laughs> Okay. It's a derogatory term. One owner. And it's from, it was, from, it was, it was actually, a, a, somebody was running a small block shop. It might have been in the Champion Speed Shop car. The original Champion Speed Shop car, which is a small block Chevy, uh, top fueler, that was running all through the 1960s and into the 1970s with a small block Chevy and staying with the, with the Chrysler. So they called the, the, the big Chevy the rat, the small Chevy the mouse, and then what's afraid of a mouse is an elephant. And that's where the 426 got its name from. Yep. Does okay. that seem kind of backwards, though? What's that? Why would it, why would the Hemi be scared of Chevy stuff? Because that the Champion Speed Shop car was fast. It's still it. So Aaron Hinckley won. Congratulations, Aaron Hinckley, on your uh, bottle of ketchup. Yeah, yeah, there's a lot of ketchup in here, bro. I mean, it's, seriously, I bought it this morning. it's barely open. It's one owner. Yeah, actually, you know what? I have another ketchup. Aaron, you know what, bro? I'm sending you two ketchups because I got another one inside here too. I think this one's got a little more. Forty-eight inch. Congratulations. Yeah, great, one owner catch it, sell win. it on eBay. We might we might use a little bit more of it before we send it though. But enjoy the ketchup. <laughs> one owner ketchup. I know what I got. <laughs> hey, don't try to move on me. I know what I got. <laughs> don't ask me any questions, just come and buy it. Right. Don't ask no, me for pictures. No tire kickers for the ketchup, please. <laughs> Freshly broken in ketchup, yes. <laughs> Sign the ketchup, Uncle T. 5,000 miles on, on the ketchup. Um, you know what? We need two nuts on that to, to, screw, to screw it down. Is it shouldered? Mm -hmm. Yes. Crackly. How long is this going to take? I mean, this takes time. I'm just wondering how long I gotta keep my arms up. Oh, do you want one of us to hold it? <laughs> no, I'm I'm fine. I'm just curious. Yeah, I don't know, three hours, four hours. Right <laughs> John is. A, you, you can do it for if you want. No, as long as my battery. If I get tired, I'll let you know. As long as my battery's charging to plug in the phone, we'll be fine. Okay. Yeah, Will it charge when it's closed? Is it charging? Yeah, yeah. 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 Is the light on? Yeah, yeah light's okay. on. What's this going to engine make in horsepower, do you think? People keep asking that. It's not, not very much more than stock, probably close to 500. Okay. Yes, fellow viewers, please hit the like button. If you hit the button, it'll, the YouTube will show you more of this kind of stuff. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you'll get you'll get every 426 Hemi build available on any given day. That's live. <laughs> That's live. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this is something that literally nobody else is doing right now. Yeah, I highly I would be surprised. If somebody else was building a 426 Hemi live right now. Just at all, probably. At the same time. Oh, you underestimate the internet. <laughs> I don't know if I do that. I don't like this kind of stuff. <laughs> I like this stuff. You should see my YouTube history. <laughs> that engine should be 500 horsepower. They did that stock. Uncorked them, and they quickly went to 550. I, I was thinking more like 547. 547? Yeah, 547. What they go to. Okay. So this was a specific intake bolt kit from Classic Industries. So there's Allen head screws, bolts, studs, you name it. And then so torque specs are go from the center. The center is uh, 72 inch pounds, and then it gets to 48 inch pounds on the outside.
Um, Brugal Armory says, why is there studs on the four corners of the intake and did you use them properly? That is what the book is telling me and I think I'm using them properly. Oh, the studs, the studs are there because there are there are different know. fasteners that mount them, like the throttle return spring yeah, bracket, the uh, um, God, the throttle return spring bracket, the, uh, the the throttle bracket itself. There's 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 a bunch of different things that that attach to. Oops. So you get the medium stud here. That's seventy-two. That one's going to be seventy-two. These are going to be forty-eight. You gonna paint the block? Yes. Yes. Pretty soon. Pretty soon. Yeah, actually, we're yeah, coming to that close. point now. Yeah. Two C's. Yeah, two C's on the back side. Do you know what you're doing, Tony? No. <laughs> no. But I'm I'm gonna watch a tutorial. Do you need me to get something? Is this, is this, I guess this one's already screwed all the way down because. It was a short, was it's a short, short stud. Short stud. Is, is it a short stud? That's what they're called. No, something right here. How do we know how screwed into the block it is? It should be 48 inch pounds. Well, okay. one, according to this. That was far enough. And you really should be going side to side. You shouldn't be yes, blocking yes. that. No, I'm, I was just, I'm not here, let me, let me get over. They don't have any force here. Okay, here are, the, here are those two nuts. You drop them right in there. David says, watching from my porcelain throne, if anyone gets pink eye, it was me. <laughs> thanks for sharing that, yeah, thanks David. Thanks for sharing it. I'm, I'm glad that got spread <laughs> right through. Thank you. <laughs> just make sure to wipe the phone off before you make a call. <laughs> right. <laughs> Why are you using a torque wrench? No need for that. We try to do as many unnecessary things as we can to look important. <laughs> you have to keep up the illusion that we know what we're doing. <laughs> so naturally, the more steps you take on anything, the more important you look. You should be holding like three tools in one hand. Uh, I usually carry, I usually carry a ratchet in your mouth. Or a <laughs> or a gear. Did duct tape a couple ratchets to your shirt. Torque by ear. When are you going to get a U.S. Navy flag? Um, we have one. We have the CBs. It's up there. U.S. Navy. I have a flag I haven't been able to put up because I've got a wall. I had it up until now. I had a wall of stuff over there. I couldn't get a ladder in. Yeah, okay, let's see. What flag is that? Let's go look at what flag that is because I feel bad. Where is it? Oh, here it is. Okay, we have to put this one up. Hang on, guys. I don't know what this one is. Uh, I'm trying to get it unraveled. Hang on. Okay, this is that range of flag. That one. Yeah, that one's got to go up. <sighs> What's up, John Wilburn? John Wilburn? Is that really John Wilburn? Yep. I believe one of these will work. It's only that one. Here, here's more of these. This one will fit. Is it metric? It is, but it will fit. Okay. I'll see if I can find some standards. Okay. Here's what are you looking for? Standby. Three eighths inch. Oh, Ooh. Sorry. Almost fell. That one will work. Oh. Here's a. Here's your button. I don't have. Oh, I might. I found those in there. But I don't know Actually, it's, yeah, three sixteenths. Sorry. What's the deal with the top of the manifold? And what's the big hole in the middle? <laughs> this is where you put your spare change. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> There's nothing, no change to be. If you have any spare change, we don't have a Hemi. That's right. 
That's right. Is Tony in the military? You in the military? Have I mentioned how much I came to dislike these fucking things? <laughs> you mentioned it. I have, Kids right? watching. Uh-huh. Excuse my French. I, I mean, that's sometimes foreign languages just pop up. Were you out in of the military, head. Tony? No, I was never in the military. I was a street punk. They wanted you though, because you were a good mechanic. <laughs> we would have taken they used to time. chase you. <laughs> yes, I was. I was we, don't, we don't know where we would have taken him. So we would have taken him. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I had a job for him at Gitmo. <laughs> <laughs> All right, tell me the torch that. I was busy started. doing illegal things with cars and drugs, so I didn't have time for the military. <laughs> I'm starting to center and work out. Tony, kids yes. are watching. But it's true. <laughs> Center ones are 72 inch pounds. Yeah, so Don't drop anything in the block. Go two in. So everything from two in. He wasn't drafted. He's not that old. He wasn't draft dodging. No, he's too young for that. I missed the draft by, by like less than a year. Only 72 inch pounds, not 75. 72. No. 72 inch pounds. Inch pounds. Not feet pounds. Not foot pounds. Pretty sure 72 would break that. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> 72 inch pounds. That's the old school torque wrench. Um, I prefer to say vintage. Vintage? No. Vintage. Yeah. Or classic. classic. Oh, classic. Classic. <laughs> Tom Wilburn says, if Tony had been in the military, we'd be able to buy breaker points at surplus stores. <laughs> it's an interesting thought. Mm. So if you guys were wondering what they're doing, the, the street hemi has a very elaborate torquing sequence for the intake manifold because it's a, a terrible freaking design. And it's just because of that, there's like... You have to, this one gets this value, this one gets that value. They have to be done in this sequence and that sequence. Later on, up for, like for race motors, you're okay to just whack them all down. You, know, you start in the middle and you go all the way out because you're going to take the intake off again in two runs or whatever it happens to be. But on this, where you expect it to stay put, you have to go through this whole sequence that he's doing right now. 72, 72 inch not, pounds, not 75. Not 75. That's right. They're all quarter twenty fasteners. <coughs> How did they? They strip out very easily, and oh, this this one's finger tight here. No, I haven't got that. Yeah, and then here's the best part. Okay, after you've gone through these once, the way he's doing it right now, you have to go through it again because nothing is going to be the same torque that it started out as. A lot of times you've got to go through this sequence three times before you actually get them to where they stay put. How do they come up with 72? Probably was some say. conversion from something to something. Yeah, so, somebody with too many brains. Tell them there's a proper sequence, too. You have to tell people there's yes, a proper sequence. Well, duh. Yeah, yeah there's okay. a proper sequence. What's the outsides? 48. Inch pounds. About 50. Right. 48. 48. 48. Oh, wait, if you add 72 and 48, I mean, that is just get like touching it. 120. So ten, just send them all pounds. to 120. You have those nuts, Tony. Four ten foot pounds. Um, yeah. yeah. <clears throat> Look, we're cross nutting. That just sounds <clears throat> so that's pretty, wrong. That's pretty fucking. That sounds so pretty wrong. intense. <laughs> that's. You ever heard of Rule 34? <laughs> <laughs> you know, I heard it for, about it for the first time in the <laughs> This morning. Don't tell me anyone. You don't want to know. You don't want to <clears throat> Just don't go do it. I'm not going to. Rule 34. If you can think Kids of are it, watching. There is a Kids point. are yeah, yeah, yeah. watching. Hey, Andy, can I borrow your phone? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Why is the spring off to the end? Over? Oh, don't even go there, Tony. Well, I'm asking. It's a pretty oh. legitimate question. Oh, you well, you we'll, can move we'll it, it there when we put the inside spring get a, in. I don't think get a dip hammer. <laughs> dip hammer. 
<laughs> the answer to that. <laughs> that ball hammer. We gotta take the, we gotta take springs off again anyway. Put the center spring. I think that center spring will center it. Up. Yeah. You what? The center spring will put them in. The water it'll, center it. it'll help center. It. These are these springs look to be a smaller diameter than the. Yeah, but when we put the inner spring in. I know. I'm, I'm just saying they look to be a smaller oh, yeah. diameter. Oh, they, they look more like There's a small box spring. Yeah, they were just a big pain in the ass to work with too. Are grab, these grab one are these thinner than? Kind of hard to tell if yeah, it's got compression yeah, on it. All right, going back so, through it, what were these? 72. 72. Not 75. Not, Not 75. 75. 75. Luckily, this is a very fine pointer. And I have your 5 millimeter, which is a really good 316. Any more yeah. trivia? Hmm. They really loosened up. I haven't had a banana in a month. Really? Yeah. Could have had a half frozen one. Yeah. Are you going to fire it up tonight? <clears throat> no. No, we're going to paint it. And then we're going to pick up tomorrow morning where we leave off tonight because the paint's got to dry. And then uh, it'll go in the car tomorrow morning and then we're going to fire it up and break in the cam and other things. We're going to do it. Yeah, we still got some doodads on the table. Dressing. You know what? I want to get yes. this thing. Cool. <coughs> Just so that we don't have to. Rhinestones. Mm. Mm. The jeweler can't. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Bedazzler. I was going to say raw dazzle, but okay. Yeah. Do you have an old set of valve covers so that we can paint it without? <laughs> no, We're going to put juicy on the. On we have. The... Uh, <laughs> uh, yes, I might. Keep shrinking these gaskets. Everybody's going to want to watch this. Yeah, you're not following the sequence. I'm kind of, sort of. Flaming burnouts and test hits tomorrow? Mm, maybe some burnouts. <laughs> <laughs> maybe some burnouts. Hopefully, we got to test the clutch. Hopefully, uh, Tony's neighbors will be uh, affordable to that. Oh, it's a Sunday. It's cool. Okay. We're going to test if the clutch holds. Yeah. We do some pretty obnoxious things out there on Sundays. Oh. Oh, 72 and a half. Polly Bun says, can we just talk a minute about how pretty the 426 valve train is? How, how, what is? how pretty the 426 valve train is. It is pretty. I was actually <clears throat> just thinking that. It is like, pretty. That is it a is pretty, valve pretty, train. pretty pain in the butt, too. Yeah, There's pain. a lot of symmetry involved in it. It's like Art Deco. A brand new one would be very nice. It's like You're pretty cool to watch run. Joe says this is literally the single greatest YouTube community. I believe that it is. We do. We have an awesome community. Except for one or two of you people. <laughs> and I got my eye on you. But hey. yeah, honestly, we have we have a fantastic community. Mm -hmm. Austin has been taking names, though. I've been taking names. Yeah, so we know who's, who's good and who's not. Yep, that's it. I got a list and I'm checking it twice. Call you Chris Pringle? They call me Crispy Pringle. Crispy Kringle. <laughs> Crispy <laughs> Kringle. <laughs> and Jay Heflin says he's talking about me. I'm evil. 
Are you talking about him? <laughs> I'm okay with evil. It's the idiots that I have a problem. Who's evil? I don't know. No, bro, you're not. You're not even on the nut. All right, well. What What is evil? It is deep well. <clears throat> oh, yeah, it's subjective. Know. Subjective. <laughs> that is what it is. Oh, shut up, John. That was dumb. You're dumb. But it was technically correct. It was technically correct, but it was just the best kind of correct. It was not. Uh, is the GTX owner happy with the build so far? Yes. That's a yes. Happy. He's happy. If he wasn't happy, we'd all be dead. <laughs> Very likely. <laughs> At least somewhat likely. Garrett is dead. <laughs> Allegedly. Uh, Chu says, stuff, Sibby, well, go ahead. This stuff doesn't raise my blood pressure. Okay, good. Is this is relaxing for you? This is actually relaxing for me. Chooch says, um, Chevy guy to the core, but this is fantastic. This is a very rare thing in 2021. I think it's more relaxing when you don't have to rely on it. Is it blurry? Charlotte? Yes. Yeah. This is blurry? It looks, it looks fun. Yeah. It looks pretty clear. No, it looks super clear to me. All right, this torques are holding. It's blurry? Hmm. Well, how we're seeing this is actually exactly how they're seeing it. I don't know. Well, unless they got a bad connection or your phone's on Wi-Fi. Don't go. No, I'm on the Wi-Fi. You're gonna have to go over. Okay, Dark Star says it's not blurry, stuff. and Big Bear says it's crystal clear. Be good. Okay, I don't know. Maybe it, it lags for a second. Okay, clear. All right. If there's a problem with it, just let me know. Okay. Now keep someone's that, saying the feed is out. blurry. Clear here. Handy. Looks just fine. Keep it handy. Mix it up. Yeah, okay. It um, out come back in distributor. So can you want to run the distributor on and set the distributors up tonight? And that'd be our. Uh oh. Um, hmm. You think it's them? Well, it got a pink. We got water pump. Okay. We got. We got the, uh, I would say leave clear. the distributor okay. out. But, yeah, no, to leave it out, do we want to bench it? Set it up on the bench? It's up to you. I mean, you could do that now. We could do it tomorrow. We could go through the distributor, look at the weights and the springs. Yeah. This thing is a work of art. It really is. Well, why don't we break clean this thing down? Because the paint's going to take a while for it to actually set up and cure and do all of that. Yep. So why don't we break clean this thing down? Give it a coat. Give it a second coat. Yeah, I got a primer. And then we got, we got the paint. What kind of primer do you have? Engine. You got the, uh, we're putting the valve covers on it. I guess that is. Austin says, can you please explain why there are 10 intake holes instead of 8? Please, Uncle Kathy, get us an answer. <laughs> 10 intake Great holes instead of 8. 10. 10. These are not. Oh, those, are, those center ones aren't. They don't go through. That's just, that's just the casting. We need to get some blue painter's tape. I don't have any of that. Uh, have you guys I think you used all of the blue tape. Yes, I have tape you can tape. use. We have, uh, hey, I got tape. Hold this, I'll give you my tape. Wait, wait, Uncle Kathy has I got masking tape in the front. Tape. Oh, you've got masking tape? I think so. Where are you seeing words? Oh, there they are. <laughs> Alright, I'll take it back. If you don't want the masking tape, I've got screen printer's tape. Don't spray that on yet. Let me get you. Let me get a camera break for you. Oh, no. I got I got I got it. What carbs are you guys going with? The stock factory AFBs. Stock factory AFBs. We're going to make a mess. So let's get is the water pump housing <clears throat> I appreciate that the intake is canted so that it is level when it is mounted in the car. We have the intake to put on, or water pump to put on. Yeah, we bolts. You actually got to paint the back of the... You know what? You, you got green tape? Separate. Nice. Perfect. Is that from when we painted your car in the driveway? Yep. Excellent. It's only two or three years old. It's fine. Uh, what type of sealer did you use on the intake gaskets? Mm -hmm. We used 
ultra black in the corners, and we use yellow weather stripping adhesive on the cork. Where's the engine run stand? Uh, I, I left it at your mom's house last week. Oh my god, Tony. <laughs> well, I know she needed to run her engine in, oh. so I dropped it off there. Oh, yeah? That's, uh, that's good citizenry. Yeah. That's just being a good person. Where's the other place, for? Andy? Oh, we're looking for one. Oh, we're looking for one? I'm nothing if oh, not a good person. Got this in the wrong hand. Well, here, why don't you. You know. Got my mom's motor running, did you, Tony? <laughs> Tony? <Yeah. laughs> it was me? hard to get started. A little cold blooded. Oh, brother. Cold blooded. <laughs> okay, where are the valve covers? Did we lose the valve covers? That's uh, the uh, loose. set I want to we'll use a set to paint on. Okay. Tony, you seem irritable. Irritable? No, it's just, it's just been a long day. Is it Uncle I've, Kathy? I've, I've run out of things to do. Is it Uncle Kathy or Ultra Kathy? It's Ultra Kathy. Yeah, it's yeah. Ultra. Yeah. I've run out of things to do. So now I'm just sitting here watching everybody else do their thing. He's also been dealing with us all morning. <laughs> ah, you've been great. Time for pizza. We had barbecue. Pizza. Yeah, a big old lunch. Yeah. Oh, come on. We oh, got John, come I on. Cooked. the hamburgers, hot dog. Oh, yeah, look at this. This is hot dog. The hamburger. Right here, look here. It's, it's 3D. Right? Are you bored? Is that, a <laughs> is that a crazy effect or what? What city are we in? If we tell Tony's you, you're not coming here, right? <laughs> <laughs> We're in Murfreesboro. Oh, you got to admit that was a pretty intense. Tennessee? Say what? That was a pretty intense illusion. <laughs> the, 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 the burger. 3D. <laughs> nobody who cool. no. Let me tell you something. Nobody who ever tunes into a live Hemi build ever expects a 3D hamburger simulation. That is a good. Point. And so that's why you need to always, you know, stay two steps ahead. Ballpark or Oscar Mayer or Kogel, Kogel, Kogel? or Hebrew National. No, Nathan's. Nathan's. Nathan's are good. They named every hot dog. Yeah, except Nathan's. <laughs> or Sabret. The two good, really good hot dogs. Sabrets aren't what they used to be. They're not what they used to be. No. But I think if you get the ones with the string, if you can find them, I haven't yeah, seen the ones with the string in like 30 years. Yeah, I don't think they the even have The ones that were tied together? Dirty water dogs. Yeah, delicious. I don't eat hot dogs, you know, because I don't, I don't want to deal with the hot dog thing. All right. But I had some Hebrew Nationals a couple of weeks ago that John caught, and they were exceptional. You made a good decision Hebrew on buying Nationals. Hebrew Nationals. Yeah, they're, really good. they're right? good. John's a good cook. Ooh, Uncle Tony, you look like you need a scotch. <laughs> you tired, Tony? I, I'm just, I'm, there's nothing for me to do right now. I'm okay. just, so I'm just, I'm just observing and hanging out. All right. How does this look so far? They all, they all huddled around the motor. Here, try to get as much as we can and not have any run marks. You know what yeah. you don't see last, enough of? Last, last, last confirmation. The Pope, huh? the Pope is not driving. Last confirmation. The Pope isn't driving it. It's oh, yeah, yeah. Per painted perfect. I don't want to do it right for you. I do appreciate it. Last, last confirmation, you don't give two craps about being stopped uh, coming. That right? kind of started doing it. This valve cover can get painted. Yeah. Well. Painted or I really don't care. I care about it. It can't get painted. I don't want you to drop it. Well, I mean, if you want to paint it properly, it's going to go on a different can. motor at a different time. So I want it just to just cover the valve control. Because like right, it doesn't have the black wrinkle finish. On. Do you need paper or a plastic bag or something to cover it with? What I'm worried about now is when I spray it down with the pre paint prep, it's just going to. I got some cardboard. Uh, yeah. Cardboard there. Maybe you should get up. You lazy. Oh no, I'm lazy. <laughs> oh, I forgot to bring the rest of it. We got six. No, bring on. Oh, they're all talking about hot dogs now. <laughs>
Don't talk about hot dogs. Yeah. Glizzies, you know. It's a great topic. No black crinkle paint for the valve covers? There's another set. There's another set. Yeah, the that's not them. This is a spare paint. set. Are you going to dyno it at Nick's Garage? I was going to send your mom up there with it. <laughs> <laughs> I think her and Nick will get along. What an ass. <laughs> <laughs> Tony needs a glass of tang. <laughs> Tony's on a roll today. <laughs> Revoke my YouTube license. I know. I know. One too many mother jokes in a single wife heat. <laughs> they weren't jokes. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of plugs will you start it's not slender, it's true. with this Hemi? Uh, we have Autolite 63s. Okay. Old school Autolite 63s, right? Yeah. yeah. So, like, he even went out and bought old spark plugs for this one. Oh, and no, NOS. <laughs> <laughs> NOS. Yeah. Well, and it's hard to say NOS with an aftermarket part. Like yeah, I guess. However, they, they were. They are not new. new. They're not new. They were useless. They're vintage. They're vintage. Useless right. Useless than the ketchup. So confusing. I remember doing this in my basement. Yeah. Can you come in here? No, I'm the poly. I remember working oh. out in your basement, and then it just stopped happening. But we're all fat, so... Yeah, that's where we're working out. Do it right here out. by the car? Uh, so I'll, I'll give you a little I'm overspray. Just, I'm not painting right now. I'm degreasing. The battery gets stoned. Let's see if I can get that on there really good. That's, that's a little not bit one, of machining right. oil, and that's not going to stick. Is that how it's supposed to spray? Yeah, this uh, this tape don't want to stick to that cast iron. Yeah. That's because it's oily. Yeah, it's now, can oily. you give me a squirt? Thank you. I have black plastic bags if you want to cover the valve covers with those and then tape around the edge. Uh, no, They're small. Okay. I'll have to strip them. We need to get that these surfaces to All good. We are getting there. Yeah, I love right there. We are squirting that clean. Yes, you're here. Just take a second. Thank you. Woo! That smells excellent. I Those love right there. Excellent. This is, this is uh, not quite free. It's uh, wonderful. This is actually That's painting it. prep. It's Napfa. See you later, Dallas. What? Dallas is leaving. His See battery is dead. Dallas. He's got to run. Thanks, sir. There we go. There you go. Hey, John, did you already clean this up here? Uh, yeah, I just wiped it down. All right. How are you doing, Sabrina? You need some 104 octane for this engine. No, it doesn't have enough compression. You can still run it. What what when you the, the, the windows on the red Jeep outside. When Jeep. you're done. <laughs> to shoot him out, you said? <laughs> <laughs> with his bare hands. <laughs> He'll do it with his bare hands. Let's see. His hands are guns. Right, his hands are guns. <laughs> pew, Register. pew. Yeah, he manually inserts the bullets. Right. No, no need for uh, uh, For a magazine. Jiffy Lube and this guy's long. motor together. Laugh yeah. out loud. Stooges motor build. Uh huh. Oh, yeah. <sighs> cover the fender. Do you want to cover painting. your fender? I'm not painting here. He's not painting. Yeah, so you somebody's thinking like I would. Hey, if you want to overspray some of yeah. this paint onto the jet, that'd be fine. <laughs> it's not going to hurt literally it's not anybody's hurt feelings. anything at all. Oh, this is wonderful. Okay. So there we go.
Muscle City Menace sent ten dollars. Thank you. Thank um, you. Tony, here's ten dollars from my mom. You're, <laughs> you're an heaven, you're an heaven legend, man. Love She's it. Awesome, man. <laughs> Thank you, Muscle City Madness. There's so many jokes. <laughs> what was it for? What did Tony do for his mom? I don't know. It was for her, though. It was for. Her. One more guy you could play is basketball. Yes, Is it for the, yes, it for the therapy? <laughs> I think this looks good enough. Come on, right there. It's nice and round enough. Shadow image of a Hemi on jet would be cool. <laughs> just put the Hemi there and then just shoot right in front what of What brand jet. of paint are you using? BHT? No. I think that looks good enough right there. What do you think? Eastward, right? Uh, OER. Well, the paint is OER. Paint prep. Okay. Is Eastwood. Yeah, I just wiped that down. Just give it a bit of some okay. Tape on it here in a sec. They're not giving us any money to promote them, are they? Man, they're no. They, they, they haven't given us any money to promote them, have they? Eastwood? No. No. <laughs> no, they're very mediocre products. <laughs> There's always time for a mind change. I mean, they're not good, they're not bad. They just are. There's always time for a change of mind, though. You must be tired. You're getting funny. Well, it's because he stopped moving. Tired. That's what happens. They stop moving, and it's just yeah, like, it's just yeah, I'm done. Uh, no, no. See. Um, no. Like I was, I was in my glory when we were having valve train issues. You know what I mean? It's like, you know, like that. You snap like too, issues? right? And now this yeah. is like, I don't. And now it's like, eh, fuck it. Excuse <laughs> my French. Yeah, Kids like, watching. Those foreign languages just French, jump out I of can, my head. I can vouch that that is a totally acceptable French word. It is, right? Mm -hmm. What does it I mean, mean in French? It means thank you. What kind of headers are you running? <laughs> Stock not exhaust manifolds. Stock exhaust. Did y'all not see that? What? Can I at least answer the questions? I got nothing <laughs> else to do. I'm sitting here like a lump on the freaking chair, and you guys are doing important stuff like rubbing the engine. Art Dylan, <laughs> Dylan 517 sent $5. Thank you, Art Dylan. Say no to chai com parts. No <laughs> chai com parts. Although, those those bolts are very suspect. Oh, the bolts, this, the 48-inch pound bolts were suspect. Yeah. 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 I like the They're a little suspect. 48-inch yeah. pounds, it should be okay. Yeah, you know. That's, hot. That's tight enough with a wrench. What do we need on the snout here? On the socket, eventually. Well, you can just leave it on. Yeah. Shit, no one's mentioned what a great job I'm doing filming. Yeah, we do. What I usually right. do with those, right? More of this stuff. You just put a couple of drops of red Loctite on it and run it down with the impact on it. It saves the violence of having to hold it from yeah. the back and yeah. Yeah, the flywheel, which I guess we'll get to tomorrow. I gotta bring those bolts. I forgot those bolts. They're able to resurface. And there was a few teeth that were nicked from that direct drive starter. But the guys were able to just pound off the ring, flip it around, and reinstall it. So we got a nice set they, of teeth. You see, nobody's going to nobody's gonna tune in tomorrow now because you already gave them the punchline. You already told them what we were going to do. <laughs> Look, I'm not tuning in for that. I know what they did with the flywheel teeth. <laughs> see, what you do is... I'm going to watch it, Nick's Garage. See, now tomorrow you put it Thank on. Thank you, like, guys. Oh, no, it's wrong. And then wait five minutes. Like, okay, Somebody we fixed tell you it. What to do. We fixed it. Everyone's saying my cinematography is superb now because I, I asked them to. Oh. Oh, yeah, no. you, have, you have incredible cinematography. Uh-huh. No, we'll just stick a distributor in the hole. You want to do that? Yeah. Okay. Oh. Yeah. Are you well, painting I, the I valve got, covers or leaving as is? We got it going on. That might be okay. We gave him a job. We gave him a task. <laughs> yeah, but it's, yeah, it's going to be all... All right. But, but then there won't be, a, there won't be a, a shadow for the distributors, see? We'll I see to, what you mean. We'll be able to paint the, behind the distributor. Yeah. You could paint the distributor. But the distributor get away. He's, like, More paint will hit the motor. Well, if that's the case, then just put the distributor in after you fog behind where the we tape is. We could just paint the hole. No, we're not painting the distributor for the motor. <laughs> Let's just not paint it. Let's just not paint it anymore. <laughs> this, I think, is the more appropriate way to go. Okay. You're doing a great job. <laughs> He is doing it. Thank he you, Peter Kovac. My camera work is ultra. And he used to do it pretty quietly, too. 
All right, I got questions for you. All right, let's answer some questions because I am bored out of my mind at this point. <laughs> okay, um, Strikers LG sent you 20 bucks. Thank you. Thank you. Um, thanks for the good content as always. Take this and buy the gang of pizza wonderful. and drinks for the hard work. We'll do. Thank you. Uh -huh. Thank you. Um, well, we apply it retroactively to the burgers. And to the burgers and hot dogs. <laughs> yeah, we we yeah. yeah, we fed everybody. <laughs> what year is the motor? A 66. Mm. 66. But it's a late 66, so it would be correct for a 67 car. I'm just going to stand here. Yeah, that was, like uh, I'm doing that was for more trivia, stuff. Tony. Hey, more trivia. More trivia. Oh, God. Oh, more trivia. Uh, they, want, they want trivia. Let's yeah. See. I haven't experienced uh, smells like this in a while. <laughs> Car trivia. Well, let's stick with Hemi trivia. Okay. You're going to be okay there. I know Miles will go for you. All right. Um, oh, yeah, I saw I that video. Yeah. Uh, I know. Okay. I know nothing of value here. All right. So, everybody knows about the, the, the 68 Hemi Darts and Kudas, right? Which are old cars. RO car, right? You know, WO car. So, RO23, oh, did I say RO23? The BO and the WO. Ooh. So, Ooh. you just made owl noise. I just did a split because I stepped on the cardboard and I thought I was going to hurt myself. I don't think uh, yeah. I don't think I was on one of them. But I already gave, I, see, I wasn't even thinking I gave the answer away already. No, you come up with something else. I'll come up with something else. This back here. Um, Okay, all right. The 67 RO and WO 23 Coronets and Belvedere's were factory super stock cars. What is the difference between those factory super stock cars and every other factory super stock Hemi package? Oh boy. There's one very distinct difference. All right, you're gotten warm in the car park. Adam Gee sent five dollars. Yeah. You Thank could you. at least give Tony a puzzle or an old block to clean up during elder neglect at the little table. <laughs> I'll, I'll go home that block over there. <laughs> uh, let's see. Um, so the '67 RO and WO car. Okay, this ben. is for this is for the mustard. All right, <laughs> glass was lighter. Glass was lighter. No. Torsion bars? No. Three carbs? No. We're fastback? No. Six pack carbs? No. They don't have no. a Dana 60? No. Three three? No. AC? No. Acid dip? No. <laughs> if they made the 426 in yeah. 1972 when SAE net horsepower became a thing, what was it going to be rated as? That's not the answer. Go watch another channel. Aluminum heads? <laughs> <laughs> no. No lightweight parts? No. Wheelbase? No. The rear leaf springs? No. What color are those valve covers going to be? <laughs> That's not the answer. Vanishing you to Nick's garage. Okay. okay. Her <laughs> shifter is the difference? No. Compression ratio? No. Oh, <sighs> the, wait. Compression ratio is one difference. Do they win the mustard? No. They win it? Because that's not the big difference. Okay. That's not the, that's the not major the thing. Answer you, you wanted. You okay. can't miss it. It's like visual. It's like it jumps right out at you. Well, uh, the one difference between... Francis says the car or the engine? The package. Were they acid dipped? No. Leaf springs? No. Wheelbase? No. Unadjustable seats? No. Iron heads? No. Factory warranty? Well, they had iron heads. No, the one <laughs> difference between Whoa. the O, the, the 67 O cars, RO and WO, the Coronets and Belvedere's, that's different than the 64, 65, and 68 super stock package cars there's one major glaring difference that you could tell it's huge it's a huge visual difference that yes cap miss. no no dana Four, no nothing jackal no her shifter jackal. no single carb intake you're getting warm four speed and automatic sabrina do you know no. nothing no no good one no was it toke boxes no That's aluminum there. heads no factory cars something factory what factory cars no. wind wings no. Aluminum body Four. panels. No. Seats. What? No. Four. Yes, it's American Four. mustard. Okay. Well, no heater. This yet. No heater and rear seat Shame. delete. No. no. <sighs> it made it different. It set these Wheel super base. stock cars. No. It set these super We're stock white. cars. What? We're white. Wow. We're white. No. Nothing. <laughs> what was the question? Uh, what was the question? <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't matter anymore. Nobody, no, mustard, nobody won the mustard. All right. 
Fuck. So, one more time. One I more wait, time. but I don't, let me get to the bottom of the comments. Um, battery in the trunk? No. Foot pedal? No. Only came in one color. Camshaft, shifter, I think. Oiling of engine. Copper coated floor mats. Copper coated floor mats is one. Posi, Posi track. <laughs> footprint pedal. We'll move forward. Pedal. Hood scoop. 392 cubic inches. Absolutely. Grill. Giving you love. Advertised to alternate lifestyle folks. No. <laughs> Tilted. Went from 12 to 1 to 10 to 1 compression. How many people are watching this right now? 600. And there's wow. not and six hundred people. I'm there trying aren't. to read them there's all. Painted knows. bumpers, hydraulic lifters, shortened wheelbase, hood, quarter panels have bigger uh, openings, magnesium just, intake. They're taking the shot. Only come in one yeah. color, yeah. color, air it's scoop, single four take. No, close, come single on. Single four intake. No. Close. Yeah, but finally somebody's actually Okay, hang on. Oh, oh god, you don't come on! Oh, automatic <laughs> eleven to one instead of twelve to one. Air cleaner, inline, Something bucket seats, convertible. What? Inline? Inline? Yeah, inline, inline question mark. Inline what? It just says inline question mark. Inline what? <laughs> Please end this. Only come in one color. <laughs> All right, so <laughs> grill, white, uh, footprint. This is yeah. painful. Cross ram? Cross ram? Uh, what about the cross ram? Single four intake? No. <laughs> what about the cross ram? <laughs> it's all it says. You won. You won. It's close enough. It's close enough. Kurt Zimmerman. Zimmerman. Kurt, you won. Where's the mustard for Kurt? Right there. Okay. <laughs> you won the mustard, Kurt. Kurt, send me your address to Uncle Tony's Garage yeah. at gmail.com, and you get the American mustard. The answer is the the 64. Spicy brown. The 64, 65, and 68 factory super stock packages all had cross ram intakes. The 67 no, RO and W023 cars had the stock yeah. inline two four barrel manifold. Owen Gibson sent you five Canadian dollars. Thank you, that Says, covers the mustard. Don't break Uncle Tony. <laughs> that covers the mustard, it doesn't cover the shipping. <laughs> Does not cover the shipping. I thought you were about to have an aneurysm, Tony. Wow, a lot of comments. <laughs> I couldn't believe nobody got that. How about a I trivia can, question I, you know, for the you know cheese? It, you know what it is? Here's the cheese. Is, Tony is, I thought, I forgot well, the question. Well, there's a greasy rag on you know, top of I the cheese. I forgot the question, too. But I knew that somebody would eventually say it's it. It's fresh. Yeah. It's boar's head. <laughs> it's lightly used. Only it's lightly miles. used. <laughs> no low ballers. I know what I got. <laughs> That's going to get used on our new channel. Did you tell people oh, about our new cheese. channel? What, the cheese? We have a new channel. We have a channel and the Facebook page is up. You guys right, can go to Facebook but I haven't right posted now. anything on it yet. Yeah, and nothing's posted on it. But this is actually going to go to our this this right here is going to go to our new channel. It's called Dogs Eating Cheese. Dogs <laughs> yeah. Eating Cheese. Yeah, that's Yo, the name of our channel. Wait, that's really? that's, that's our new what, channel. That's, I swear to God. The channel is up. I just haven't posted a video yet, yeah. but it's, it's just up. Dogs Eating Cheese. The Facebook yeah. page is up. Facebook page is up and so you the YouTube channel over, is like up. The Facebook page. I haven't posted anything yet though, but I just got them up. <laughs> it's called Dogs Eating Cheese. Yeah. Oh, this was, I thought this was a joke. No, oh, it's no. my channel. We don't talk about stuff like that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what? Yeah, bite your tongue. Dogs Eating Cheese. Dogs, Dogs eating, eating Cheese. So go over to Facebook and go like that and share it with all of Can your you? friends. Can you and we'll have videos phone? up. My phone's about to your die. Phone is within, dead. within a day or two, we'll have something up. Is it your dogs eating the cheese? Huh? Or anybody's dog eating the cheese? It's going to be just the universe okay, of dogs There's a charger in my and cheese. Oh, okay. Dog consuming hat. cheese. We got it, but Uncle Kathy is not reading the comments fast enough. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Are we still taping? Yes. We're still taping. Give the monetization on. What? Yes. <laughs> yeah, I was worried about that. Yeah, I mean it's at it's at the beginning. Andy, I thought this side was cheese really wrapped in bacon. Dogs eating cheese oh, okay. is probably a German euphemism. I hope not. No. No. It's, it's legit as dogs eating cheese. It's, it's like as straightforward as you can possibly get. <laughs> this is not a joke. <laughs> We're not joking, people. We're not joking, people. No, I already made video. I, I just didn't it. post it yet. Where is it? Dogs eating cheese. Yeah. Where are you? On Facebook? Facebook? Yeah. Right here. Oh, it's right there? Yeah. Wow. It literally is just dogs eating cheese. It's literally... That's, that's it. <laughs> that's it. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? How do I... Wait, yeah, the just, profile just, picture. Let me, just let me 
probably just go ahead and yeah. like that one. <laughs> 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 no, it's the dog. <laughs> <laughs> That. What? What is the? It's <laughs> <laughs> just a bunch of cheese. How do you make that? This is this is like meta deep internet stuff. It's a good show. It's just don't see me. <laughs> Listen, there's a lot of jacked up things in the world today. Right, I know. A lot of really jacked up things in the world today. So I felt, we felt, yeah. that we need to counterbalance that. It's just those yeah. medium cheese. That's With my something that's just good and simple and straightforward and pure, and it's fucking dogs eating cheese. Did you laugh? So, yeah. Right, uh, right. Well, so. I, hope, I hope it's oh. just dogs eating cheese and not, you know. It's what dogs you just eating said. cheese. I, uh, I got literally. That's what you just said. I got dogs. <laughs> Literally eating cheese. eating cheese. Speaking of Facebook, I got banned from Facebook yesterday for calling somebody a pine cone. That's excellent. And then yeah, taking yeah. a screenshot and reposting it, and That's then I got banned for a month. Why would you hate on pine cones? I called so, somebody a pine cone. Is that derogatory? <laughs> yeah, uh, I guess. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I, so whatever. I don't care. I don't know. I'm not up with the derogatory thing these days. Okay. Pine cone, huh? We doing? All right, we've got two uh, distributors to set up. Hey, shut up, pine cone. So if you 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 <laughs> talk get banned. You're talking about trees. Yes, the pine cone. Derogatory. Call, Wouldn't that make you an, ar yeah. an arborist? No, like just somebody <laughs> says something infinitely stupid. Okay, what about uh, you want to discuss spring lights in there? It looks like we got a heavy and a light. Right, but you got a stick. Um, yes. So we're going to leave that alone. I'm just for people. I don't know where a wall oh. Works. Explain for people. Well, yeah, what am I explaining yeah, exactly? It's car. if this was an automatic. So this is this has got the this has got the curve that Chrysler. This is a, an, an actual Hemi distributor. So this is the factory curve that Chrysler put in there. It's actually fairly light. Yeah. And you see it's got two springs. It's got, it's got a light spring and a heavy spring. So if, this was, if we were setting this up for an automatic, especially one with a tight converter, we'd be taking that heavy spring out and giving this light spring a little bit of a stretch. If we really wanted to have this, this thing to have some snot, we'd pull, if we pull the weights out like this and weld these closed, these slots closed, so we just had full advance. But this is set for, I think it's set for uh, 18 degrees initial. Or, I'm not at 18 degrees, uh, no, no, it's set for 22 degrees centrifugal. So we're just going to leave this alone. But this is a stick, and he's going to be launching it above the RPM at which these would come out, which you don't get that with an automatic. So well, there you go. Did I explain enough? Yeah, it was good. Anything else you want me to say? <laughs> I think that covers. <laughs> <laughs> Let's, uh, so I will really assemble French that. onion, really. <laughs> I will assemble. I could this. do that again. I liked it. It was good. Okay. Take. Well, you got the job. <laughs> Did I pass the audition? <laughs> you got it. All right. Let's show people this wonderful breaker plate we're gonna put in again. Ooh. Ooh. That yeah. Makes you happy. This. Oh. So. Yeah, he went and found an actual new old stock Presto Light breaker plate for the dual point. And it's like, ooh. Brand new. Brand new points. Vintage NOS points. Those don't look like vintage NOS points. Nah, bro, these are. These aren't the good points. Oh, come on now. They're not. Hold on. Where is my old? Where's the distributor? Is it a felt on? Not that the one. Others? Hang on. You got the dual spring. Let me see here. I got, a, I got a. I got. I got a right here. Don't rain on my parade. <laughs> well, no, you're right. Okay. Ha uh -huh. Wait a minute. Say it one more time. You're, you're right. And I'm all right. <laughs> <laughs> Say it again. <laughs> Here was the old one. The biggest thing I noticed is that one has yeah, the two dual the, spring. The black. One has the dual spring. And then having the... Uh, you mean you mean this? This is not uh, the one set of points has the dual... Has a dual spring set up. Oh, okay. And then I like how the coil has the metal bar yeah. instead of the, 
I'm sorry. Oh, no, Tony here. is wrong. <laughs> no. Are you wrong? Yes, I was wrong. <laughs> Yeah, I was wrong. <laughs> what did you do? Oh, I said, I said something wrong, and I don't remember what it was. I blocked it out. <laughs> I'm in denial of my wrongness. That's the way to deal with it. Yeah. Okay, we're going to set up these two distributors, though, off the motor. That's the goal. So we're going to have a Mallory, and we're going to have the originals. <laughs> Fuel pump needs to be. Oh yes. So you don't want the fuel pump at all. I don't want the fuel pump painted though. No. At all. Okay. Um, I'll give five there's, bag. There's bag uh, there's there's <laughs> newspaper in the trash over here. Yeah. I would the, just do uh, that. The factory. I'm pretty sure they sprayed around the fuel pump. Like, the fuel pump is on there and has overspray. Yeah, but Amy's a little angry about that. Okay. <laughs> you could just not have the fuel pump. I've been around here a long, long time. And now it's a big one. I can't get some of that fuel pump. People stepping to dogs eating cheese. Thank you, Muscle now. City Madness. People are still eating dogs eating cheese. Yeah, why wouldn't, why wouldn't they still be dogs eating cheese? What is it supposed to be? It's just dogs it's eating cheese. It's going to be dogs eating, eating cheese. Eating, it's just so it's metal. Um, yeah. It's metal? How much food have you given my dogs over the years? I don't like to give your dogs food because then they come to me. And they're like, give me all your food. I'm like, no, dog, this is my whole pizza. <laughs> oh, God, I need pizza. See, I had the high, I had those hamburger yeah. buns. You want to bag it? Now you've opened the, the, the <coughs> gates of flavor. I think you I told me to get easier. barbecue stuff. Oh. Except the barbecue. I'm trying to just go on around, do a little tight on. I didn't want to eat bread either. Just, bread is so good there. there. I know. Yeah, we went to Maggiano's last night and just ate like most of the bread. Yeah, we had to wait to come out of the oven again. Yeah, Carabas is really good too. They bring out, yeah, they bring out fresh baked bread, yeah. and they have the garlic, the, the, the olive oil with the, with the seasoning. Yeah, um, yeah, that's what they were doing. It was yeah. fun. Thank you, her, James Menzies. Really? Yeah. Yeah. James sent a dollar ninety nine. Oh, thank you. Yeah, we uh, went to Maggiano's. I wore one of my suits. She wore one of her main coats. We took the Plymouth out there, and we looked like we should not have been driving that car at all. <laughs> no, are you kidding me? See, see people will look, look at that car and they're like, whoa, that's... Yeah. You know, uh, they don't know. What's going on there, Andy? They don't know. Well, they don't know anything about cars. They know that they see Barrett Jackson, you know, and... Just they, having they, some they, fun. They're turn <laughs> Barrett Jackson, these cars go for thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars. My brain is functioning you know. on all cylinders. She's got, she's got two of them. One of okay, them you work on that. Yeah. Cover the cheese. And, uh, uh, the cheese has been secured. But it's always funny. Safe when we from drive the dogs. Up. It's always funny when we drive up in the pond somewhere nice because it doesn't look nice at all. <laughs> now you think? Uh, oh, it looks pretty good. It looks good. Yeah. I you're mean, really I, you're I, really you know, shortchanging your own handiwork there. I, prob I probably am, but I drive it every day, so I notice everything yeah. that there is. So just wait until you take your other car back, then your nose might feel good about it. Just wait until you get your other car back. Yeah, I want my Mercury back. Mm -hmm. You fellas are actually eating? Yeah, they ate. I'm doing things. I'm totally not just standing here. I am doing everything right here. You just can't see it. Alright. Not perfect, but it's bad. Have a last year add-on. Oh, water pump. Water pump. Just needs to be checked though. All you have to do is here. <laughs> sure. Would you get me a water too? All right. Yeah, I'm gonna get a close up here. Let's let's watch the tape coming off of this. Get you right in on the action, guys. <laughs> right? Two dollars for dogs eating cheese. Two dollars. There's concentration. Uh, There's the face of concentration. Okay. Do the back and forth action effect. Exactly. <laughs> And make everybody sick. Yeah. Look, yeah, at, look at these guys go. This is like this. this is high speed, like rocket surgery. Let me get, let me get this right? shit done. Oh, did I say shit? Sorry. Sorry. I'm working. Totally have something to do. You know? Look, he's awesome in 3D. Yep. Okay. Stick out just, paper. Right. Exactly. 
I was uh, I was in the shop one time and there was a guy that stuffed a bunch of rags in the bottom of a diesel engine so he could work on it. And he never took them out before he fired it up, so we spent two weeks cleaning lint out of the fucking bottom end of that. Beautiful. Yeah. It was a... Yanmar? That was fun. I'm just going to do this number right here. All right. All do is it's a water pump and a water pump and a water pump housing. All we got to do left is this. I can't read any of these comments because I don't have my glasses. Austin for governor. I guess Mopar painted the aluminum back in the day. Oh, well. Yes, they did. Yeah. Back in the uh, day. Yes, yes, thumbs up for Uncle Tony. Cast. Or I, I, oh, man. Remove the tape in between the carbs. They taped them between the carbs? Oh, my God, they did. Okay. We'll have them, we'll have them, we'll have them do that. Ah, oh, let's see. Let's look at what Andy's doing here. Andy's putting the distributor yeah. together. Excellent. Trying to sink it in there, but it is not going. It's getting really close. <laughs> Extreme zoom. <laughs> Hold on. You can really see the detail there with that angle time. Yeah. yeah. It's uh, That's the totally clear. We need some. That's a good shot. It Please. is a good shot, actually. Look, I could do this. Yeah. You could be a tripod. Right, let's, get, let's get Andy. Go with the concentration. <laughs> All right, concentration. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah. Who said remove the tape between? You got a gap in there. Yeah. Well, you want that orange. You want it inside the intake manifold. Yes. Orange. Yes. Yeah, because you're going to see that in between the carburetors. Okay, it's hmm. Andy, do you want me to do that? I guess I might have to have you. This gets okay. I got it. Okay, okay. Yeah, it's being cantankerous. What's the deal here? Are you firing this thing this weekend? <laughs> Did you? Yes. We hope tomorrow. to do it tomorrow. Are you pulling the points apart? No, no. no. I'm just trying yeah. to sink it in. Oh, was you it to, around the can? Yeah, yeah, the yeah, 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 yeah. I think I was. Yes, I believe I was around the can. So. Come on. Uh, hey, Andy. Yes. I'm going to expose this port in between both of your carburetors. If that is what, if that is what the Mopar gods tell you to do. Then no, that's something. that's everything that isn't this gas. Everything that isn't this gasket it should be it should be handled. She's just being a little bit of a pain. Oh, does that include uh, inside? <laughs> well, <laughs> well, you know somebody's going to do There's one in every crowd. Everything We're going to run rustoleum injection. Come on. Yes. <laughs> it'll, it'll never cease. Kurt Zimmerman sent $10. Thank you, Kurt. Best channel on YouTube. Thanks, guys. Thank you, Kurt. Let me get that crystal light. You, you passing that off to me? I was well, I was... About ready to pass the baton. Hey, John. What do you want? Where's the distributor for the jet? Why is this? There's my crystal light right there. It's just being contentious, yeah, getting it around to the... Yeah. Maybe there's, there's something nice in here. Yeah, maybe. It's got two condensers. Yeah. I think I this, added a second condenser. I think this ear is just bent out a little, which is causing it is. my problem. Yeah. So. Actually, they both are, but... Yeah. <laughs> Why is that two condensers, Tony? Because I added a second condenser to it. Oh. You just okay. Said that. Oh. Because can you really ever have too many condensers? I on figured we just like, like have like nine of them in a line. I thought about that. And no points. <laughs> just one big spark. It's just one Boom. giant. That's like your California emissions camshaft. It's yeah. perfectly round. All the cam lobes are round, yeah. and it's got nine AGR valves connected end to end. <laughs> Sounds like a late model. Oh, there's a chair here. I'm going to sit down for a it's second. It's not a chair, it's a stool. It's a stool. Okay. Oh, let's see. Let's see. I wouldn't be docking around with that distributor. That should be drop in ready. It should be drop in ready, Andy. Well, oh, yeah, Andy, you're, don't, you're don't mess around. You should be dropping yeah, that in. It should be ready to go. Yeah. I'm trying to get it ready to go. <laughs> 
No, that doesn't count in the world of the internet where this guy lives. <laughs> Motor Trend will never notice us if it isn't ready to go. You're wasting time, guys. Come on. <laughs> oh, we've been, oh, we've been wasting all kinds of time. Don't kid yourself. Sabrina's working we've been hard. We're having a big party. <sighs> Let's see. I'm trying to get it ready to go. Working hard. Right. You can do it, Ryder. You can do it. She's just, just catching it. on the inner lip here. You can do it. The hole isn't lined up. I can see it from here. Not yet. Yeah. I mean, I'm just trimming. Mark, can I help you? Yeah, you can make sure you see it. Yeah, I was going to say it's bad for you. Yeah. <laughs> it looks pretty good. Now you got it. Oh, let's see. You don't get, you don't get here, but don't have armchair puncher here, okay, Mr. Swinger? <laughs> they must be getting paid by the hour. I guess you're going too slow. <laughs> you're going too slow. Tony. Hey. Going too slow. I, I mean, I don't want to just rip it out of his hands. He's trying hard. Well, he's got some bent pieces, right? Mm. Well, yeah, it's tight in here. Yeah. I should have bent it more. So why don't you pop it back out? And... Yeah, I was hoping I could just take you're it not gonna, You're not going to get the threads lined up, man. Oh, I'm so close. Yeah. I know, but the, you, you, you'll never get those, those screws started easily. Right. Put the screwdriver <laughs> in... Put the screwdriver into the advanced slot and pop it up from underneath. See this, and this is why I get paid the big bucks. This is very good knowledge. Finnegan yes. would have this done already. Huh? Finnegan would have this done already. <laughs> oh yeah. Finnegan wouldn't even need these parts. Uh, he'd use hot dogs. The leftover hot dogs, hot dogs? instead of the distributor. <laughs> He's probably action hot dog. Yeah, action hot dog. Okay. You two looks worried. Do you look worried? No, he's just tired. Uh, let's see. Scotty would have bought a Celica already. Yes. <laughs> oh, Scotty Kilmer? Yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> that guy. Austin has sent me so many Scotty See how much Kilmer easier videos. that is? It's not it's about great. how easy it is. <laughs> it's Sometimes not what you have about. to choose the harder right over the easier wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Kids these days. Andy, you done yet? Yeah. Hey, have you done yet? No. Are you done? Yes. I'll yeah. never be done. Well, hey, Tony. Hey. You care if I appropriate some of your tobacco? No, please. Okay. All right. Ta-da. Well, y'all want this uh, now. Off here. Which side? Uh, wherever we're going <clears> to <throat> be. Maybe that. Don't put the rock in there. No, I'm just. I'll probably have to do some. Oh, more brake cleaner on it. It's going to be oriented. Yeah. That gets clocked off. It's all right. So this is the this back. Is the <laughs> Here you go. Hey, Kathy, you want to you want to show the finished yeah. product? You did a nice job on that, man. Oh wait a minute! Before anybody starts bitching. So this is what I used as a template. There you go. Very nice. How many hours is this now? It's what? Eight. Yeah, at least, right? Well, it was like 6.45 when the first stream crashed. No. No. That was? Yeah, it was like six, six hours. hours. No. Into the six, six, six hours. Of, okay. Yeah. Rusty Bridges sent $2. Have Garrett tied up in my basement. Whoa. Want him back? <laughs> no. <laughs> they don't want him back. <laughs> no, you're, you're fine. The gimp? I mean, we appreciate the two bucks, <laughs> but you don't have to give Garrett back. Motor That's looks right. nice. Figure out some way to escape. See, dripping glass says motor looks nice. Good. Thank you. It's getting there. He's getting there. This stream might be getting boring. It doesn't look like it's working out. <laughs> What's that? Maybe tomorrow you all will drop it in. That's the yeah, plan. Kind of plan. That was the plan. plan. Yeah, that was the plan. Not yeah. today. Yeah, it has it's to just... get the paint's got to dry. Yeah, we got painted. 
That's why we got this cool green frog dish that's on the tape. That's where the horsepower comes from. <clears throat> this is like watching paint dry. No, you'll oh. see that, that that's coming. That Are y'all going to live stream paint, paint all night long? Please live stream the drying paint. <laughs> <laughs> Just leave it running all night. We could do that. Just live stream the paint. Just have it I could actually here. do that. Just have it sit there. God, please do that. Watch the paint dry. Watch the paint dry. Consider it done. You just gonna leave the live stream on I'm with the light. Leave the live stream on all night. <laughs> just rename it after it's done. Just, just paint dry. Watch it paint dry. All the clicks. We'll have Gary yeah, come by there and like the during the night. Just come yes. there. Three a.m. Yeah. yeah. He just comes uh, in and no, sits. The and then walks out. And then leaves. Comes by and uses a finger. Yeah, it's a weekend build and install. Right. We still have tomorrow. Yeah, like. <laughs> <So he> says, <laughs> set up a camera like the fireplace Christmas. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Christmas music. Oh my God. And he's crying by an open fire. <laughs> Great. Between the traffic noises, you could probably actually just let that run and get some off it. This wire. I better get more beer. It's gonna be a long night. Oh, God, he's got one way paint. It's stinky. Uh, and guess what? Third time the charm, bud? What? Yeah, yeah, third time. Yeah, it took you a little bit to get that thing lit. Come out, spring I was just going to soak it in gas. This is uh, it's how we start the grill. This is all right. <laughs> So it's not going to go this way. It has to go this way. I think it really can, right? I mean, if it, what if it just... Well, the problem here is the, the orientation. See, they're both... I know. That's what I'm saying. Right? I mean, the, the, the memory is to go this way, which is... Fine, right? Well, it, it won't. It can't go that way. I mean, it physically can't reach the two points going that way. See, see, they're closer here. It has to be goes upside down, yeah. this way. Reverend James says $1.99. Did Hemis oh, here, have a here, higher here. amp alternator than 440? No. Uh, than a 440, no? Peter DeSanta said $20. Thank you, Peter. Thank you, Pete. Here, it's got to go this this is gonna be like this. Okay. Sabrina's working hard on this. No. <laughs> What's the girth on you're, Tony's fingers? You're undoing. Wait, you're undoing the spring. <laughs> Distributor surgery on this episode of UTG. This is intense, guys. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. It's already, it's already joined. It's already joined. This is the wrong wire for this. No, he went to take the trash out. Well, this wire was incorporated into this wire, right? What do you mean? Yes. It's doing the same thing. Yes. Way. Yes. This is redundant. Right. So let's just take this one off then. He says, what is problems you don't have with an electronic distributor? Yes. Uh, this, is, this is nothing. It was this Jeopardy? Our, our, <laughs> our fingers were touching and that was gay. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Get in there. It's good. It's good. Well, we should have done this before we dropped it yeah. in there. Oh, wait. Give me a 516 box wrench. 516 box wrench. Open in. Thank you, sir. What? Smaller than a 516. Okay. I guess quarter. Hold on, eight, three seconds. Now I got it.
It was All right, hang on, Andy. Cut. No. This this style here goes with this style points with the separate spring. See, this this captures the spring. Yes, okay. Yes. This one doesn't capture the spring. But does that matter? <laughs> Waiting for you to throw it and kick everybody out. <laughs> That's right. Ooh. And then that'll run across there. Okay. So let's. <coughs> yeah, too small. So it's not, it's not five sixteenths. There's seven thirty six. Okay, so it, it appears we don't have the uh, correct size for this. It's fifteen sixty four. Oh, Bingo. See? Okay, so the size for a Presto light is 15 64ths. I've never seen that before. You wouldn't have an ignition kit? They're usually 5 16ths. That is a weird size. Huh. What is that for the, for the points? Yeah. Huh. It looks like Phillips had screws on. Okay. Husty Bridges sent you dollars. Says Garrett escaped my basement. You guys better hurry. Well, we didn't know that you resurrected him. So <laughs> this this usually goes there. There's ground wire here. Yeah. Uh, you know, looks good. The old one looks good. Yeah. Okay. We got this. We got this. Apparently, Bingo. Garrett escaped to the guy's basement. Oh. Okay. We're owning it. it. We got it owned. Look at that. That's like much, much better than new. Much, much better than new. Only I, I missed, I missed the spring. Cause I'm not wearing glasses. I need glasses. I can't see a freaking thing. Oh, thank you, sir. <laughs> <laughs> As I say, they, they ended up there somehow. Oh, there we go. All right, how are we doing? Now everything makes sense. Holy mess. What else needs to be painted? Not that. These wouldn't hurt, but they already are. Would the heads of the bolts be painted? Of everything that was already. Oh, yeah. Uh, this would be assembled. Oh, yeah. There probably is more stuff on them already that would be painted, too. But... Alright, you guys are good over here. We got intake manifold exhaust. Exhaust is done up. Um. It'd be great to just stuff some newspaper here, guys. Okay. Over the flywheel. And where the... I don't care about the inside of the flywheel. Oh. You see some newspaper around here, John? Newspaper is... There's a box back there, but it's kind of that dark. A whole bunch of it's all covered up. Sandy, you said you just wanted it around the, uh, yeah, the back so of the we paint, We just don't get uh, spray on the flywheel. Okay, and I mean so on the uh, back of the crank. Okay. Are you going to move the motor so you don't paint your car? I will move the motor. But because the exorbitant cantilever system we have holding it is actually movable. 
Well, um, I, I, when I perceived that repair, that was an excellent fort. <coughs> I put some under and then wet it up. I says, oh, it needs to be movable. Okay. Who's, who's ready for Christmas? Santa Claus. I'm ready for Christmas. They're going in. They're going in. They said, tarp the car, leave the motor. Take it outside and paint it. It's pretty much outside. It's pretty much outside. It's called Soto. Soto. You know, this is not the size. Like, oh. I can force it on there. There's a, you have a choice of like 17 different ones. Well, I'm telling you, we, we, we got it. Is that to your liking? Okay, I believe we're good here now. Well, that's why we'll bench test it. All right. Thank you, sir. Yep. Okay. All right, you have the... Uh, The vacuum in, pod. Yeah, right, vacuum what, advances what's right there. Side? Vacuum advances right there by Mark. Straight in front of you. Thank you. And then the bolts and its washers are no. Nope, nope, drop it. Nope, to your right, right, right. To your, toward you, toward you, toward you. To your right. <laughs> I'm with this under the Yeah. I'm waiting for something bigger. <laughs> 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 All right, wait, there's something, there's something drastically wrong here. You like when things are wrong, right? I actually do. Yeah, but <laughs> so you can fix it. <laughs> Did you break it? Out, so it? you no. have something to fix? If it was 180 out, it would have made sense. John wants to get a picture. Brother man, I don't think this breaker plate is compatible <laughs> oh. no, I had it in there. with sure with I with the vacuum pot on it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I did. Pretty sure I did. Right there on that. Yeah. So now look, I, I plug this in where it's got to be. No. This has got to go up underneath. There's something wrong here. Okay, so that's in. That's in. Oh, geez. Be yeah, we're not even close. We'll break the plate to the left right there. Right there. Is the, hmm. the uh, ground strap. Here, orient it the same as this. Where is it? Where's its holes? Right there. So here's the. That's how it would be. That's, this is how this one would sit in there. But I'm. Yeah, it's a completely different breaker plate. Roadrunner James sent a dollar ninety nine. The negative battery cable needs to be orange too. Yes, actually, it's a good point. It's over here. Wait a minute. It's already half orange. It's half orange. It's already half orange. So we'll make it it's full just orange. Just one eighty out. This. Where's the? All right, hang on. You're saying that's a high quality Chinese knockoff. No. What did they sell you? The hot dogs are starting to mummify. Yes, is they this, are. Does this help at all? That plate is 180 is out. Sorry. That's a small block oh. one. Oh, yeah. The breaker plate, the, the way it connects is, is it's on the opposite condenser. side. Yeah, because it's a small block. Totally. Yeah. Just for right there. Like it landed in the box. Out. Wait a minute. Yeah. Is it possible to be upside down? I think you got, I think you put it in backwards. Maybe. Which would explain why the wires wouldn't 
672 E Galaxy says the plate is 180 out. Yeah. That's what I thought, okay. Well, that makes sense. That's why I was having some problems. Talk about troopers, man. Some of the people have been watching this life hours today. Yeah. I like to think. Oh, we can go back to the I didn't ever remember passing one of these wires under the ground either, so yeah. yeah. My fault. Getting tired. No, don't beat yourself up over it, old no, chum. <laughs> <laughs> How to sound encouraging and condescending at the same time. <laughs> Well, I have to oh, sound like a hero a on the internet. The issue was I had the, I had the, I had the vacuum 180 upside down, which led me to believe that the vacuum's doodad was. That was my, that's one of my issues. My fault. Cherry mistake. Better to find it 180 now instead of later. Well, we wouldn't be able to find it later because we wouldn't have been able to assemble it. All right, now wait a minute, wait a minute. So, this wire has got to come in through that slot. That's not right either. This wire has got to come. Mary's lunar. <laughs> Wait, here, take, take this. Not here. <laughs> this is going to be the hardest part of it. Mm. This here. Okay. So that. This is. Mm -hmm. Is this right? Where's the back end? Really? All right. Yeah, so that's it. Ignoring you. I'm a fight. So hold on. Uh, How's Denise? Let's just stick this one. So um, she's in. just, uh, you know, all the, the way. Hair dogs. All the way. Yeah. Can you yeah. tell them they're bad yeah. and they become sad. Okay, so I was right. So I was right on that. Yeah. Except for Doug. She doesn't do anything. She just looks. 672 E Galaxy sent $15. All right. Thank you, 672 E Galaxy. Epic day for you, TG. Thanks for taking us along. Thank you. Well, I'm, I'm glad you get to watch us fumble here. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah, the trolls are enjoying themselves. If you want, there's a yoga mat over there. As usual. There is a very nice mat over there. No yos in 5 -0. No <laughs> well, shop yeah, cat. No. <laughs> just, just lay somewhere and then just be seen in the background laying on the floor. No. Yeah, I'm gonna what happened? This is the chill stuff. out mat. This. It's probably something to put your feet on when you're working on the car. Here. Put it like you know, and like, I don't know, but you don't hurt your feet. You, know? you don't use a ottoman to work on a car. Okay. <laughs> no, I'll take it now. This is the same Yeah, the guy that sent us the, uh, Here, the guy that sent us the guy that sent us the guy that sent us the guy that John uses it when he leaves it to lay on the ground. Well, here's the, here's the, here's the, here's the original one. Because you don't hurt your back. Okay, so this is the orientation that's correct. The shoulders, that's I'm saying. So here's the pin for the vacuum. Right, so here. I can remember that. But here's where it's not. That's right. I get it. That's not. I'm doing it like a Yeah, yeah that's, that's this is right. Yep. And this is, this is, this is 180 out. Yeah. That's a small block one. <laughs> the vacuum, the vacuum <laughs> part on the small block Demonized. faces the other way. I'm banned from. So we have to put this one back together. I saw that. It's hilarious. I, I was furious. <laughs> How did this were you, possibly? Were you Plymouth furious? I was Plymouth furious. Okay. Okay. So. I'm good, Yamsen no Paivo. How, How are many, you? How many people are watching, Kathy? Uh, 558 right now. Oh, that's not bad. Yeah. That's more than we were watching earlier. In I'm going to find out how many I'm going to watch paint dry overnight. Yeah, I really want to see that too. Are y'all really going to do watch, that? Watch, it's probably going to be our most successful. 
video? I'm yeah. gonna. I will put. No, it, just, if you do that, I will put it on this on my TV when I go to sleep tonight. Just really gonna have it. Just on paint dry. Yeah. Hemi, Hemi drive in the shop hours. overnight yeah. ASMR. I might have to log in. Just yeah, just, just to watch that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you just occasionally hear a car go by. Man. Oh crap, it's starting to feather in place. Oh god, it's trying. Oh, Look at it go. Oh, it's, it up. it's running. We're yeah, watching two <laughs> drops race each other down the block. Because you know, every or, single like car detailer out there is going to see it. Right, Big oh, Bear yeah. wants to watch the paint dry. People really want to watch, watch the Yeah, they're going to watch it, yeah. All right. Okay. Okay. That's 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 brand new. We'll that give you what well, you want. Let's, let's, you one step at a time. Let's, let's put this. <laughs> like, yeah, I have a set of points in it. There's going to be people though. criticizing okay, the paint. Okay, so we're here. I know. Like, <laughs> yeah. Technique? Like, no, not no, no, not, not the way the paint job was done. No, I'm talking about like this takes way too long to flash off. What is what kind of this is like watching drag racing? racing. Yeah. It's so yeah. see that on YouTube. <laughs> UTG live. It'll be paint it'll drive. be really funny when I, I get another. It's riveted on one side. Yeah. UTG live. It's riveted on one side. Riveted on one hour block, just sitting on YouTube, but uh, hey, watching paint drying. Just let it run all night. So all night. Yeah, it's twelve hours of paint drying, and then it picks up when we all. And it's angle Tony. Doesn't look like he lost weight. Shocked? He did lose weight. It's the way he's weight. sitting. Come on, <laughs> bend it over. Uh, Be encouraging. I man. know. Be so mean. I'm <laughs> I had two burgers. Are you Do I see smoke? Six? No, he's not smoking right now. Hey, where's that Mopar guru? How far up does the negative battery cable get painted? He said all orange. <laughs> the whole thing? It should. It the no, thing? the lead no. shouldn't get it. No, because when they painted, it was just hanging off the side of the motor. Right. This is that's probably wait, pretty really accurate. Yeah, I think that's accurate. Yeah, that's I would leave it like that. I guess so. That must be Tony is what peak thing. performance looks like. <laughs> Alright, let's look at the motor and see what it is. I mean, where's the water pump? Okay. Uh, well, we had Tony, you look marvelous. Thank you. So water pump? I feel marvelous. The, the bell housing. Distributor doesn't get paint. Engine fuel pumps are, covered are, up. Do you, it just dawned me that I'm sitting like the fat know? old guy. Yeah. In you the know? chair? Well, don't the, sit the like that. The, the one on the mobility scooter? Yeah, don't sit like that. Sit. Straighten out you your back. We're thinking about putting... Uh, what about the accoutrements off the, off the uh, intake? We've got... These look correct. They're already painted. The carb return spring. Can we put a 426 in a golf cart? Can't we do the distributor? <laughs> well, at least give me the stuff to put the distributor together. Yeah, I just want to get these guys. Oh no, it's do. suffering. There's something else to do. Uh, Can we put a 426 Hemi in a golf cart? I mean, look at it. It, it can be the seat. Maybe. I mean, yeah, you just put a couple of people in that. <laughs> you just put a, a like a like a stool cushion on top of the intake. On top of the air cleaner? <laughs> yeah. yeah, you could actually you could do that. We'll pad the valve covers. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You got that yoga mat over there. We just cover the engine in great stuff. Are we working fine? Everybody's saying it's buffering. Is everything okay? We still running? Because I did click off for a second. I lost the connection for a second and it came back on. That's probably why it's buffering. It'll come back. You should have blamed me. They would have believed that. <laughs> Blame Derek. Is it good? Okay. We had to get the nude back in there for a little while and he screwed up and hit the damn wire. We, Jesus. Could, we could just blame Garrett because he's not here to defend himself. No, he is here. He's just in the trash can. Oh, that's right. Yep. How do you log in? They cannot speak. See what? Was he logged in? Okay, no, good. Yeah, no. just refresh it. I really should have had more coffee. I would have brought you coffee. I asked you and you ignored me. Oh, I was busy. I was I was actually being useful. They needed me for something. And now you're not so useful. You like, can get this food out of yeah, you can now get the I'm food out. You can take the food out, Tony. <laughs> I'm pretty sure there's still a See? pack of hot dogs sitting on the back of Plan Z over there. There is a pack of hot dogs and there's some brats. Well, those probably be refrigerated at this point. <laughs> You'd be like the bus boy. I mean, how can I? Oh, make... Andy's being the bus boy. I mean, how, how can I make? What's this car? <laughs> How can I make myself useful? I'm just sitting here. I don't know what to do. <laughs> I, I, well, if you wanted to clean out the food, that would be awesome. Yeah. 
clean right, up the food. Yeah, you go clean up over there. Oh, 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 I get to put this together? No. Now I get to put it together. No. no. What am I going to do? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to smoke a cigarette. You can help. Don't yeah. smoke. You can help. Andy needs help. I don't know what he wants help to do. Help him. Okay, well, you take that screw up. <laughs> Supervising. <laughs> Let me know when you're taking the screw up. This reminds me of everybody I've ever worked for. Huh? John, I'm going to need you to work right harder and huh? not. Not right here. Right. Just keep, there. keep doing well, some I'm, paint. I'm working here. with the handicap. Andy's not handicapped. No, uh, no, but, not yet. No. Lee. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That was a handicap. I, was, I can't think of any other way to describe it. These army guys can do it all, Sid says. It's still daylight in Tennessee, yep. <laughs> Uh, let's see, Roadrunner and James, Uncle Kathy asked them if the headers need to be painted and heat burns off the paint. They're not using headers. They're not. The original exhaust manifolds would have been on the car and painted and the paint would burn off. But I think You don't that want to duplicate that experience? Yeah, it looks like smell of burnt paint. It's great. It's the all I don't think American it's a necessary mm -hmm. evil moment. It's like that and putting cheese on it. On a dog. So here's something, right? So pie. here's some, no kidding, Lubra no, points, no, right? Who puts cheese on apple pie? People in Wisconsin. It's done. So I'm watching, I'm watching this, uh, the Graveyard Car Show. Yeah. Okay. So they go through all of these crazy steps to make sure that the overspray is perfect here and that's there and that thing. And they put the exhaust manifolds on the engine to paint them so that they have that, that duplicated thing. And you know what they've got behind the exhaust manifold? Those silver exhaust manifolds that they they're from Felpro. All right, I'm gonna take the dollhouse outside and just start praying. They can't even warn you. Tony eats yeah. cheese channel. No, it's you dogs eating out, cheese. Water pump on it. Dogs eating cheese. It is the yeah. newest don't, internet don't sensation. Waste a lot of paint on There's the no videos up there yet. No, <laughs> but trust me on this. It's the newest <laughs> internet <laughs> sensation. It will be. Yeah. Obviously, the closer it is to the motor, the more important it is. I'm going to use this entire can of paint from Bell Housing. Oh, uh, let's not do that. The Bell Housing is completely invisible from the top. I mean, you got to work with me a little bit. I'm, we already do. I'm trying to, trying to, 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 to rile <laughs> He's not going to rile me up. <laughs> Try to get his blood pressure up a little bit. Unless you're jumping out with 12 of your friends at 30,000 feet on oxygen, this doesn't get your blood pressure up. Jumping out of the plane? That sounds like something yes. I want to do. Well, if you want to sign up, I can help you out. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think where you're taking me. I, I know it's a joke, I know. <laughs> and I have a rod in my leg. You don't really get to pick a profession either. Oh, that's not uh, true. I scored high enough on the ASVAB that the Air Force would have let me do a little bit of that. Yeah, but then you would have been Air Force. Yeah, but then I didn't go. You would have just spent the rest of your life getting made fun of as if that's not what you're doing right yeah, now. Make it made fun of with a pension. <laughs> Who cares? Yeah, he's got a point. <laughs> I'm not as stupid as right. Sal, I'm just as stupid as I look. Well, you look pretty damn stupid. That's, that's right. right. So, it's just, they call it a quota. So, you're saying is that you would be a diversity hire? What? <laughs> what? Take it's like, so you're saying you're, you would be a diversity hire? Yeah. Okay. That's not real. At least I've never experienced it. All right. This is exciting, isn't it? I'd like to try to find a way to make it more exciting. Okay. Right. Well, is that right? What are you doing, Andy? They're asking what you're doing. Well, so I'm rebuilding the distributor's breaker plate. So <laughs> I thought we had a NOS one for the big block, but it turned out to be one for the small block. 
But in anticipation of that going wrong, we bought some NOS goodies here. An old coil, an old Condenser. looper plate. I'm sorry, I keep saying it. Condenser. And a couple sets of points here. So, so the instructions with this are install point sets so the wick is on the side of the distribu distributor opposite the condenser. They call it a wick? The John Wick. What is a wick on the Oh, for yeah. the can. Opposite the condenser. Jonathan Couchy sent twenty dollars. Thank you, John. I guess you guys are not worried about car overspray. Here in Minnesota, we weld our cars together from scrap metal because there's nothing left. Currently, what I'm doing with my single cab shorter power wagon. Well, we're gonna. It's gonna go. It's gonna get rolled away, so there won't be any overspray. But they're just they're just cleaning right now. Yeah. I'm going to focus intently on what you're doing. <laughs> I'm going to sit here and wait for instructions. Is there any Entenmann's node, these guy we own? What's that? Entenmann's. Is there any Entenmann's cake? Oh, the cake. <laughs> Fortunately not. Andy's running away I somewhere. I could use some Entenmann's cake. There's actually donuts over there. How about coffee? I could use some coffee. You want me to go get coffee? Do you want to take my phone? You can take my phone and I'll go get coffee. You have to do this, though. Why don't we just leave the phone and go get coffee? <laughs> All right, sure. Okay. I don't know how my internet connection is going to be, though. Should be okay. Maybe you're going to go on a coffee trip? Or a yeah, we're going to go on a coffee trip. Live coffee I trip. might lose it, but I might lose it. We can. Yeah. If we lose it, guys, just, just we'll give us 10 up. minutes and we'll restart it. Okay, we're going on a coffee trip. Yeah, we're going we're gonna, to, it's only about 8 or 10 miles. By the time we get back, you'll have a set of points in This there. gear goes counterclockwise. You cheese cranky. <laughs> I am, I am, I got to tell you. cranky. I'm cranky. <laughs> what do you say? The, the gear, the, the, the lobes are going counterclockwise. Yes, counterclockwise. So that would make sense. It hits the wick. Oh, the spray the on the lens, is it foggy? Wait, hang on. Is that better? I think this set goes You need on. some super saw? <laughs> so it's what I install the point set so the wick is on the side of the distributor opposite the condenser. Oh, all right. That would make sense too. Yeah. yeah. So all right, set. so are we going for coffee and coming back? Yes, we're going right. to go for coffee. Does, Come on, guys. You want to take a ride? We'll go get some coffee. We'll take the Jeep. <laughs> okay. Anybody need coffee? Andy, do you need coffee? <laughs> I do not drink coffee, but oh, thank no. you for asking. Okay. All right. Everybody coffee? coffee? Do you need coffee? Uh, we're going for a coffee then? Yeah. yeah. You want to go for a coffee then? Okay. All right, come on. Unless we're, we're going to put that somewhere where I start painting. Otherwise, I'm waiting for the primer to dry. All right. So, want you want coffee? I want coffee. Coffee. Okay. You want coffee? I mean, I'll take some coffee. You want yeah. coffee? Hey John, you want coffee? I would love coffee. Okay, now now we're talking. Now everybody coffee. wants no, coffee. Okay. <laughs> All right. You take the order. Okay, I take the order. You take the order, and I'll pay for it. Okay. No, we're just doing how many? Just count them up. Five coffees. One, two, three, four, five, six. Is this the right seat, Tony? Does this ground strip go to the six adjusting coffees. screw? Yeah. Right? yeah, it's riveted on one side. Yeah. Right, and it should, no, actually, it should have its own screw that it goes to. That's what I was wondering. Move it. Huh? But you can put it to that, that's fine. Just so I don't see another spot. Precarious. Where, where is it on the, uh, that other brake plate? So it was on there, too. Yeah. yeah. No. Actually, it's under. No, we're not going to Starbucks. We don't do Starbucks. We do, um, Racetrack. I do Starbucks. Racetrack has great coffee. Racetrack. Yep. So Woody sent twenty dollars. Here's some money for coffee. Thank, Thank you. So. Come on, guys. Let's go for a ride. We will get coffee. All right. If we lose you, we'll start up as soon as we get back. Oh, oh I thought you were sending me to get coffee. No. No, no, no. we'll go. Is there All much right. more to film? Is that comfortable enough for you? Is there much more to film? Yeah. For what? Do you want to film the actual painting or? Yeah. Yeah. If okay. You, I mean, if y'all want, we can take it. And if y'all want, I mean, the way you don't lose connection. 
No, oh, that'll be all right. Okay. All right. So then you want to, we get the sure. distributor together and then run it on the bench and set the well. If that's what you'd like to do. I think it'll be awesome. That way when we stab it in tomorrow, it'll just fire okay. right up. Well, it's going to take you another 10 minutes, put 15 minutes to put that together. By the time you do that, we'll have coffee back there. Sweet. All right. Okay. We're on it. Like an Easter bonnet. Make sure everybody like a Shakespeare talks. sauna. <laughs> Make sure everybody talks a lot of trash about me. Okay. <laughs> Come on, let's take a ride. All right. I think I'm going to lose connection. No, you'll be fine. Whoa, what happened? Did we miss action? I don't know. Yeah, something happened. Oh, okay. So. I picked this up yesterday. I'm gonna make oh, a dirt geez. bike. I'm gonna make a dirt bike out of this. What am I getting? What, you, you want one? No. <laughs> uh, I'm building an iron head dirt bike. Really? Yeah. Because it's back now. Well, there it goes. Yeah. Oh, but now we're phone. back. I guess it's on my phone because it left. Um, oh yeah, it, go back in there. Go you want me to go back? All right, all right. I have to stay. All right, I'm gonna stay. It's gonna hook me. It's probably gonna go out again because it's gonna hook me back up to the internet in here. You have to stay. I'm gonna take a different woman there. What do you mean? <laughs> you don't expect me to go around. Are you gonna get me coffee? Yeah, I'm gonna get you coffee. Also, I gotta borrow your thing. Are you stealing her? Yeah. Okay. I like her. I'll tell her last. Okay. I'll have a large coffee, please. Okay, we're gonna bring back a lot of coffee. All right, thank you. I should take a break, right? I know. I don't know which one's more valuable. What? Oh, he wants money from me. All right, hang on. <laughs> Here. <laughs> I said, oh, he wants money from me. <laughs> it's mine. It's mine. It's got my name on it. Aha. Uh -huh. That means nothing. All right. <laughs> money is good. Yeah, it helps. It helps buy things like coffee. Oh, uh, let's see. Give Austin the phone. Yeah, here, Austin, do the phone for a few minutes. All right. I'm going to get some water. Okay. I can't believe Tony stole my fiance. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm holding the camera. What's Just up, John? Like that. Yeah. Oh. What's up, guys? Let's see here. Oh, so, we're going to sneak this in. Yeah, I guess the, the, the Tony didn't take him on the coffee run. So, this is where we're at so far. Wait a minute. Let the uh, paint experts roll in right now with their advice. I have to sign off on the paint. <laughs> Free paint. This thing's going to be beautiful. We got 380 uh, likes and 500 people watching. Well, hello, everybody. Oh, now it's 498. You shouldn't have talked, Andy. Sorry. Right. <laughs> <Scared> him off. <laughs> oh, now it's back to 501. Hey, you, you net give positive. A shit about the yep. don't have them. No, that's okay. Oh, they're saying dude walked away from the t points again. What? <laughs> saying that Andy left the points on the table. I did. And Chuck is saying, please paint the darn thing. <laughs> Trying to. And Michael said that we missed a spot. Chocolate well, chocolate. please tell me where. <laughs> Eugene says I'm still contemplating whether to like or not to like. I think Sigmund Freud was asking the same question. Yeah, like and subscribe. <laughs> Austin like got a gal. Like. Yeehaw. A Ab, that's my fiance. I've had for. Three years. So, I mean, well, she wasn't a fiance, she wasn't a fiance for three uh, years. Like, no, no, we've been together for three years. And Tony just stole her, so, you know. Professionals. Uh, Roadrunner James is asking what brand of paint we're using, Andy. Uh, um, I got it from. Just say Krylon. Krylon, just no, it's, it's just not, paint. It's just from OER. <laughs> yeah. OER, here you go. Oh, there we go. OER. This is the primer and the engine paint. Oh. Let's see here. Dope. Okay, hold on. Let me get this. 
I'm going to be painting here too. Your audience has spoken. Say what? I'm painting here too. Yeah. I already got the, I already got the business. Oh shit. Things are getting real. gonna blow that. Yeah, better not. <laughs> you smoked all of your cigarettes. I smoked all of my cigarettes? That's yeah. just, uh, that's just too bad, John. Well, that's okay, because I got one more. That's fine. Well, wait, we're gonna need more. Go tell Tony to pick up a pack of smokes. Go tell him. Yeah, just go tell him. They're gone, so. They're not gone. They, they're airing up something. Just go out there and be like, hey, get a I'm pack of camels. Just go, 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 go. Just run out there I very quickly. Just go very quickly. Gotta go fast. <laughs> <sighs> what you got going over there, Andy? Just gotta like blow it off now. Oh, blow it off. Mm. Put your eye pro on. Alright. I'm gonna be launching like okay. cars. I'm good. Alright, well I guess. Yep, there it is. Copperhead Road! <laughs> it's Copper Seal Road, I believe. <laughs> Abel asked if it's new old stock paint being used. <laughs> Did you hear that, Andy? Shit, it's 40 years old. <laughs> if you look at those cans of pre, they're probably about 20 years old. <laughs> so, yeah, they, uh... <laughs> All the aerosols gone and the paints of brick inside the can. Okay, Dude, I think you got a cat in here. Huh? In here. Yeah. That's gonna dick up my paint job. Oh man, it's gonna run. Casting flaws. But you wanna hammer that out? Nope. Sure. Yeah. Man, the stream of watching the paint dries is gonna be the best thing ever. You know one of the Light is green. It it might hit green light. Say what? It might hit trending if you title it ASMR paint drying. <laughs> uh, we'll start. Remember, just the light coat. You know, the, it's just primer. Yeah, but light first. Let it touch up. Oh, you want two coats of primer? Well, as much you, as didn't, you didn't put that in the order. Jonathan Couchy, thanks for the two dollars, man. He's asking what kind of camshaft is going in it. Camshaft is a uh, comp cam. On the card here, Austin. Sure. I don't know how to read it, but just up top here you'll see it's a four four degree offset. I'll hold this up for a second. You know, I don't know how to read a cam card because I'm just that ignorant. So but this well, is what's going your, in. You've got your duration at fifty, and yeah. then you've got your total left. You've got intake and exhaust, and you've got your timing. And everything's all right here. So so this is what's going in it, you know. <laughs> ASMR paint drying quote of the day. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, so this is what's going on. That's what people like now. I don't get it. It's like a skin crawl. Look at that. ASMR videos? ASMR stuff. You know, that stuff actually kind of works, though, every now and then. <laughs> that, uh, like, uh, oh, stuff that makes, like, your spine tingle. Like, you know, that kind of weird cold chill thing. When I hear certain, like, there are people in videos where it's, like, they're eating chips. Oh, yeah, I can't stand that. Yeah, no, I have the thing where I can't, I can't listen to that. Yeah, yeah. you can look about those, though. I mean, dude. Yeah, no. Then your parents teach you some manners. John doesn't have manners. You know what? <laughs> you know, I <laughs> screwed it up. What'd what I do? What happened is, while you were turned around, I was going to paint some, and when you turned back, I was going to stop. Oh, you know what? I'll just and turn around. Turn. And by the time they were done, it was like, oh, crap, it was all prime. But that's okay. Well, they can hear the paint gun. The paint can. Paint can. Oh man, look, it's it's gray now, guys. It, it it's. No, I'm not This is done. what we call. No, I'm not uh, done. I'm not <laughs> done. <laughs> okay, let no. me just. No, I'm not done. Did you figure out the breaker plate? I'm getting there. I'm getting there. 
All that stuff is just voodoo magic to me. Okay, uh, William Fieger asks, he has a serious question for you, Andy. Uh, okay. Would you buy new old stock oil from Mopar from 1967? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Now you could probably you do could an oil stock. analysis on it and see if it was still good, but... I was say, yeah, that's a lot of work. I mean, that stuff, like, degrades over time. It's not the oil that degrades, though. It's the additives, right? That's my understanding. Yeah. That would be my assumption. But if it's conventional oil, I have no idea. Yeah, I don't know. It's been in the, you know, the oil itself has been in the ground for millions of years. But... Before it was heavily refined. Yeah, you know. Oh, look, it's done, guys. Motor's ready to go in. It's done. <laughs> no, it's not. You suck. It actually looks really good. You suck. It sucks. It sucks, Mark. You got to do it over again. Yeah. Well, hey, oh, you see, there's still orange on these bolts here. You know. I'm getting to it. Uh, I'm not done. This is slipshod. I'm not freaking done. <laughs> you can't freaking hammer one side or you start drooping on you. Oh, the oil filter's getting painted, too. Is somebody saying that? No, I, I just oh, okay. pointed it out, but now I'm somebody like, will I'm say like, it. I'm like, okay, so they really haven't been on for the last 12 hours. When we said we were going to run, like, just a quick oil. Yeah. And then change it all out. See, this just do. devalues the car by about 37 cents. So, what's up? What's up? The, the, the paint on the oil filter, that is a 37 cent reduction in value. Until they did Oh, no. Now it's 39 cents. That's wasted paint. This thing looks really good. Way better than my poly turned out. Of course, I did that in my backyard. Wish I had a paint gun, Andy. Uh, actually, um, Garrett left his paint gun here. No, I mean like... Like a, like a, like a high-volume, low-pressure paint gun. Well, we'd have to suck the paint out of, or the primer and the paint out of the can. So oh, yeah, that would suck. That would suck. Let's see yeah, here. I love that smell. Isn't it great? It's almost like a cleaner. Somebody said, Austin, if you work on it, the value will drop. That's <laughs> likely. That is likely. <laughs> you know, I'll, I'll try to keep up with the comments. We're doing this on the phone, so they kind of fly by a little quick. Let's see here. Let's oh. see. Something cool about gray primary. Yeah, isn't that right? Yeah, look, doesn't that engine look good in gray, John? Look at it. It's called Hemi Gray. It's Hemi Gray. What do you think, John? <laughs> no, I just got a message. Oh, it looks good, though. Apparently, really? people are being mean. People being mean? Yeah, apparently, it's me still watching. Oh, do, oh uh, that's okay. Hi, Denise, by the way. Say hi, Denise. Hey, babe. <laughs> that's his girl. <laughs> Why isn't there a rattle in whipped cream cans? <laughs> That's actually whipped cream. So this is just what's left when all the cream's gone. Ah, Denise says hi. <laughs> she said, hi. <laughs> hi, handsome. Thanks, Denise. I know you were talking about me. Uh, you know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. oh, you know, this damper is still orange. Yes. Mm. I am coming around and taking Can care we... of Mr. Damper. I got... Did somebody comment on that? Mm -hmm. Somebody comments on what? On the so damper's orange. Okay, hey, this, is just, this is just for you. <laughs> I think that was Austin commenting just because I wasn't commenting. Were you? I mean, you literally just said that though. No, I, I was just pointing it out because. Oh god, you know. I still have that whole broke the jaw thing on my feed. Ah. Oh, bad fumes. Yeah, you're done. Mm -hmm. It looks really good. There better be donuts or cake on UT's return. Yeah. <laughs> There's donuts over there. Patty O Furniture. In the box. Uncle Tony eating a sandwich ASMR. <laughs> what? Uncle Tony eating a sandwich ASMR. What are you talking about? Just uh, the comments. Comment. Oh. 
I think, are you just in there? I didn't see that one. Yeah, I just Ooh, I need to move back. Oh. Can't see. It looks gray, everybody. It's a beautiful gray. Oh, there's a spot right here. Bunch Ooh. of spots. And I'm sure uh, Andy got two cans of primer because, you know, there's like 16 colors on this engine to begin with. Let me see. One can of primer. Yep. <clears throat> One can of primer. Well, first coat's always the hardest. Update on there the points and sole, please. Perfect. Okay. How's it going? <laughs> so, we are just getting everything lined up here. Get everything in place. Surprised you didn't have a six foot hero for lunch. Yeah, yeah, six foot heroes, right? <laughs> now probably pizza. No, we <laughs> we put the barbecue on, and we did hamburgers and hot dogs and brats. Oh, you didn't spray paint the other side of the timing pad? Oh wait, actually, hang on. Let me see. This needs to fire up tonight. Tonight? No. <laughs> no, she won't go tonight. All right. John Wilbur put the knee set in timeout. <laughs> I think so. <laughs> Probably open that door. <laughs> Probably that idea. open that door, yeah. It's a little... Spray painty in here. It smells better over here than it does over there. I think, uh, I think John Wilden put the new some time on that. <laughs> what time are we beginning the stream tomorrow? I'm not sure. Do you know? Uh, no, I don't know. We don't know? Okay. I probably would, early. I would guess, let's say early, probably nine. Yeah. Uh-oh, I gotta go get my battery chute, which I put in the truck yeah, okay, we'll to on. charge. Um, okay, I've got 15%. I've got a battery. So, uh, I put it in the truck to charge because it charges faster in there, and then they took, they took it. Oh, boy. Yep, so I've got 15%. And uh, let's see if they get back in time. I've got a battery. You guys want to go? You do? Yeah, what kind? But it's uh, like so the, in the, in the, the room with this like, zebra, zebra couch. Mm -hmm. You'll find a, a a bag with my name on it, and then there'll be a red, big battery pack in a, uh, most likely in a small camouflage. It's not going to matter. Pack. He's got my cord, too. Um, Is it an iPhone or no? No. Oh, oh no, I don't. It's USB-C, I've got one. All right, well, you Let's see. We'll see, guys. <laughs> If they get back in time, it's no big deal. This one's hard. We put, this one's we put the water pump on. <laughs> well, why is it overheating? <laughs> wow, that is some potent paint. Yep. A hole in the table? We're only going to charge you a double price now. Triple. No. Wow. Tony well, runs against Hawkey. What's three times what? zero? What's three times zero? Three times zero? Will it be the Iraqi special price? <laughs> because I know how to work that. <laughs> Tony wants to get coffee. So. He stole my fiance. Yep. You never should have brought her around, Tony. All right, so we're getting the primary set of points in. The primary wire goes to the coil, and the condenser is set up. Get, just get the other side. Other side set up here. Samsung. If it's uh, made in the last couple of years, it should be the same. Pretty much all Android is with PC now. Hang on, guys. I'm trying to plug my phone in. I move around a lot. <sighs> no. 
Check it. Come here. Let's leave it into your device here. It's hard here. to see it. See it? Oh yeah, that should go in there. Is it going? Yeah. It's not going. Just uh, line it up and uh... yeah. Line it up. Oh, I think it's in there. Is it? No. Nope. No. Nope. Nope. How many people does it take to plug the phone in? Yeah, I hope that doesn't. There it goes. Okay. Hey, it's charging okay. now. All right, cool. All right. Thanks. Okay, we're charging. We won't die. <laughs> We won't Damn. die. We won't die. <laughs> Isn't that the end goal of everything? Or just the end result? It's an inevitability. Oh, this is a nicer battery than mine. Look at this. Wow. Very nice. Oh, but this is the best part. <gasps> yeah, I gotta charge. get one of those. Solar charge. Oh, that's neat. Very nice. Join the special ops, Miss Kiff. <laughs> Say what? Join special ops. I should they join special ops, charger. yeah. <laughs> Whoa! 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 Break it's stuff. table. No, but that is a nice one. Uh, Outex boxes. Yeah. They're not paying us either. No. <laughs> okay. I get in that secondary set. No ventilation, no. We opened the other door, though, no, there so is cross it's not too bad. Ventilation. It's a lot better than it was. Yeah. Oh, we're sucking up all the fumes. That's ventilation. Coffee yeah, and cannoli, your, your yeah. That'd be filter. good. Yeah, we're filters. That's all the human body is, is a giant air pump. Okay, so Reverend James wants to know, um, are you going to use a Repro Mopar coil? But Emma, uh, we have a uh, no. I have a master have blaster coil over there. I think. Okay. Not an Excel super coil. Not an Excel super coil. Are you going to be live for twenty four hours tomorrow? Well, we're setting up the paint drying live tonight. <laughs> it's the greatest thing ever. So we'll set that up, and then tomorrow morning, we'll start again. Like the stream begins right at, like in the same stream as the, the paint drying. <laughs> you just pick up where it went off. I guess we could do two separate live streams at the same time. Yeah. They don't need beer. They're all high from paint. Fumes. Okay, we're getting close, <laughs> everybody. What can I help you do? Uh, at this moment, thank you, John Brennan. need to assemble Brennan. some of these parts here. Yeah. If you want to just uh, hand me put the these uh, put these through the holes. Yeah, but wait a minute. These are the. Where are the vacuum? Hmm. Are we missing something? Um, the screws for the vacuum advance. Here we go. Here we go. These are, I don't know if those are the vacuum. Quiet without Uncle Cranky. <laughs> <laughs> I think those are. These go through. Yeah, these are. These have to be longer because there's that, uh, that plate there. Okay, here we go. So, uh, here we go. This. Hey, Joe Brennan said he likes the dogs eating cheese page. For Thank, you. Oh, no. Thank you. Thank you, Joe. I'm good on. I got one on my hand. Oh, so oh, you went to get coffee. Yep, sorry. Thanks. Okay, we should be able to see if this works here in a second. Or how it works in a second. Just get this breaker plate down a little bit. Let's see. This is going to go on here. Do hemis so. even need the dual points, or can they run fine on single point? So I don't know the answer to that. I am sure that they would probably run fine single point, but the dual point you allows I do have my for more. If uh, we have, I have a dual meter. Okay. I got one of the old vintage auto tune ones yeah. out there. Yeah. Cool. Um, anyway, so the, the dual points are just neat because it allows more. Um, time 
for the coil to recharge, right? So the individual point dwell is set at, I don't know whatever the number, it's pick a number. 20, it's a 26. 26, but if uh, you run dual point, you get the dwell down to, uh, I'm sorry, the dwell is expanded, right? So it gives the gives the coil more time to recharge yeah. and then lets it go. So okay. it's, on a, in an on essence, it cuts the amount, or does it cut the dwell? On, on my Mallory, uh, setting the points at 20 uh, creates a dwell of 26 degrees if you set them both at 20. Okay, so, um, so the dwell is the amount, the, the dwell is the amount of time the points are closed. Closed. So by having dual points, you in essence trick the system to make it think that the the points are closed longer, the yeah. way that it's, they're offset just a hair, right? So uh, yeah. it allows the it allows the the coil to uh, recharge better. So anyway, a single point ignition, I'm sure, would work fine on the head. Yeah, at high RPM, it gives it more dwell. But at higher RPM, it gives it more dwell. That's right. Just throw a magneto in it. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> so I know about magnetos from our Alice Chalmers. Uh, I do like those quite a bit. We want to crack those points so fast. <laughs> oh, oh, hell no. So the thing you have to do is set the, set the gap, there, Jackson. which I'm not sure what it'll say for my gap, right? But you loosen up the dwell, and you can stick a screwdriver in here <laughs> and change the relationship between the upper and lower points when it's on the node of the lobe right there. So when it's on the lobe and at max opening, the amount of space in between there is the gap, right? So we'll have to set that with a feeler gauge. But then we'll also, my plan is to set it up on the... Uh, mock it up on the uh, vise and actually run it and set the dwell by uh, by using a dwell meter. You know in the comments? Oh, no, I was just asking for it. Oh. <clears throat> Did Tony go to Columbia to pick the beans? No. <laughs> <laughs> it's a little bit of a trip to the oh. gas station. So complicated looking. <laughs> Yeah, it's really neat though. So, and I think Tony's shown everybody this before. But if you watch this set of points first, you'll see that they hit right there on a lobe. They hit a lobe first, so they open. And on a normal ignition car, the coil would fire. But the coil doesn't fire now with the dual point because this is this contact has not yet hit <laughs> its break point when it's set up correctly oh, it looks like it is now and then it will eventually <laughs> hit that and then Ooh, they'll both close cool. again so anyway it just lengthens the amount of time that the coil has a chance to recharge that's it that's it okay all right i think she is <laughs> now let's see if we can get this one hmm? remember to use the points lube before you put it in what? the engine slash yeah. put the cap on it no yeah, Sky so a good point, I, I shall. You two going to come back on another motorcycle? Do <laughs> you hear that, Kathy? Yeah, I hear it. <laughs> I think we're ready for uh, orange paint, Andy. I, mean, I doubt it. Oh, hey. oh, we're so ready. He's got oh, we own an espresso oh, machine. Nice. When it takes all the bills. Very cool. <laughs> okay. Oh, let's see. Like the Russian dance. Tony's waiting till the like paint fumes are gone. Dance. Yeah, maybe. How's paint? I mean, you stop working out because it lands on your leg, but you know, it looks like you're uh, perfectly fine now. Oh, my. Ow, my leg. Is that the right one? Yep. Okay. Um, two number nine says time to recharge. You mean time the coil has a closed circuit to the battery? Yes, that's my understanding. Okay. 
Uh, Joe K says I'll be popping in and out. Can't stay for multiple hours. Good luck, UTG crew. Enjoy the coffee. Looking forward to hearing this thing around. Awesome. Thank you, Joe K. How was the cam chef situation, Andy? So, um, well, it ended up well so far. The comp cams um, is the one that ground the cam for me. And they uh, responded very quickly, so I appreciate that very much. Um, you know, they, they, they did indicate to me that the cam bearing surfaces were uh, were oversized, and I wouldn't I wouldn't they didn't indicate that they were way oversized, but they did indicate that they were on the on the uh, max side of things. Anyway, they were able to uh, send us a shipping label. We sent it back to them, I believe, on Monday. They worked on it on Tuesday and. They called me Tuesday night, uh, told me that it was down in the spec, and we discussed, you know, where it would be for the Mopar specifications, uh, and they said that they took it uh, really between the min and the max. I said, okay. Uh, they put it uh, in the mail, and I had it back here to uh, Tony and Kathy on uh, Wednesday, I believe. And uh, Tony put it in and checked it, and it, uh, it is, if you will, true all the way down the length. And it slid in, and the clearance on the bearings seems to be fine. So the cam's in. I think we're happy with it. And I am happy with the customer service that they provided. So I don't have anything negative to say about that. Okay, there you have it. Uh-oh, I think I hear it. Did I hear a door? Yes. Yep. Coffee's coming. Oh, he's coming. Oh, I think I heard Sabrina coughing. Andy, come over here and touch this. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> come over here and touch this, Andy. Kids are watching. Glad it worked out. Nice cam story. Glad it worked out good. Kudos to come cams. See, we say good things too. And good things are deserved. Here they are. Mm. Way to go, yeah. Com Cams. Yep. Entomans? Call Uncle Sabrina now. Entomans? Uncle Sabrina. Why? Why? <laughs> All right. Because you're cute. Well, well, can I put this one? Oh, yeah, it's clear as fuck. Yeah. Okay, right. Wait, is, it is that screw important? I have a camera. Yes, it is. I can't. Yes, thank okay. you. There's, there's creamers and sugar and stirrers and everything in there. Wait, I've got a camera in my hand oh. and no place to put this. There you go. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. Well, I'm not used right. to making the coffee ones. This is my first. What is the can That's my say first coffee one ever. You should let it dry. Uh, That's your first coffee runs ever. No, it's not. Yeah. Stop. <laughs> is this my coffee? Why would I make coffee runs? I don't know. Is is, uh, I'm, I'm the big guy. It's <laughs> Uncle Tony's <laughs> garage. You know? Other so. people are supposed to make the coffee runs. <laughs> uh, you took my fiance. She was just going okay. to go in and She's the only woman I had besides Who needs milk and stuff? I drank black. Okay. You need creamer? Bro, you she did a beautiful job. Uncle is a term of endearment. I'm yeah. gonna have to go back and watch the replay of this to see how you did that. Uncle We're coffee. getting there. Uncle coffee. <laughs> no, I'm good. Okay. Thank you. We are Kathy, getting. Kathy, you want creamer? Oh no, thanks. What? Okay. Thank <laughs> they called it Uncle Coffee. Uncle Coffee. <laughs> Uncle Cranky's garage. Yeah. <laughs> you see the primer <sighs> Is there a difference what? between Uncle Cranky and Cranky Uncle? What? Because no. <laughs> of accoutrements. Here, there's shit to put in your coffee. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Tony. You're welcome, brother. <sighs> it was so quiet and calm while you were gone. <laughs> it was relaxing. It was very relaxing. Andy explains, you know, what he was doing, like, nice and calmly and very steadily. Right. Yeah. <laughs> You could say it was like watching paint dry. <laughs> wow, that's not nice. The primary motor is just... It's epic. gorgeous. Yeah, it's ready for a warning, Andy. Yeah, I would just leave it gray. It's oh, hemi-gray. Yeah, that's yeah. even better, hemi-gray. It'll uh, go great with that brand new orange water pump that I painted. 
All of it's gone. I don't know. I, I mean, what it would be good if you did like a cow. There's more, there's more uh, sugar in that over there. There's more what? Sugar? There's Joe Jackson says Andy is a worker. Well, I appreciate that. I try my best. That's all I can do. What's going on there on that? Let's see. Um, is Andy going to repaint the GTX or keep the patina on it? I am keeping the patina. The most I'm going to do is clear it probably in like a satin clear to preserve it. Yeah, that's a good idea. I think it's nice the way it is. Right, so what's the next step? What are we up to painting this? Okay, we are... This is ready for your inspection. Okay. But we need the very little... They don't close till midnight. We're good. ...cotter key for the vacuum advance. Uh, it won't come off. Yeah. Well, here, have this. Well, then I guess we don't need it. It physically cannot come off. Well, what color code is the GTX? It's B5, right? Well, no, no it's, it's a Q. Yeah. 8-8 eight, eight was the paint code back okay. then. 8 blue and blue bottom, blue top, black interior. Beautiful, huh? Yeah, did he try to kill you? No. He didn't try to kill What'd you. What did you get from it? Oh, you did I didn't. Yeah, kind of. Oh, didn't. Sad. <laughs> um, it's supposed to be 17. Yeah, I got the specs over there. 17, 17 thousands and between 38 and 42 degrees as well. No intimates, Tony? Intimates? Yeah. No, they didn't have me. I'm starving. <laughs> starving? Oh, I'm starving. I, do you want me to get you food? No, if no. We're, we're not going to be too much longer here, really. There's hot dogs there, yeah. Yeah. There's hot dogs. There are hot dogs? Yeah, but they're old hot dogs. No, they're fresh. I didn't cook them. And there's also brats. So we gotta start to fire up the grill again. You have to light the grill again. So here's what I was ah, I'm trying to explain this while you're going. Okay. You can tend to bump. Contact gap 14 to 19. Individual contact dwell angle 27, 27. to 32. Yeah. Total dwell 37 30. to 42. Yeah. Well, so I was trying to explain to people how the dual points leaves the, the the coil more time to charge. So what happens is there's overlap. Okay? So if you watch as 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 the lead set of points starts to close, the other set of points is still open. So what you're doing is you're spreading out the amount of dwell time over more degrees without increasing the gap. Does that make any sense? So if you if you were to gap these, let's say if you were to gap a single set of points at at uh, at, at seventeen thousands, we give you approximately thirty degrees of dwell. But two points, because they're staggered at the same seventeen thousands, we give you forty degrees of dwell. And that's why they, they it's why they did this. So. Why'd you give me twelve thousands? I did that's what we used earlier. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> They're saying to give them pizza. <laughs> Do you have pizza, Tony? Oh, uh, no. No? He was drilling over there. Hey, you know, I got points for a free pizza at Pizza Hut. If you, you guys want pizza? Yeah, I got, I got a free pizza. Yeah, I just haven't redeemed it yet. Where's the pasta visual? <laughs> no, it's a cigarette. Alright, clear hot. The doofuses are closed, cleared hot to paint orange. Oh, yeah? Okay. Well, what do you want to see, Tony on the distributor or the paint? Go away! Go right, away! I'm going away. <laughs> We're going to see paint. The nozzle on this, this nozzle is white. Sucks. Yeah, it's not good. Blast the, use the primer nozzle. 
You know, there are some good nozzles in some of the paint cans we bought that actually spray instead of just, you know, really just take them out. So. Yeah, because that's going to pull up. If I mean, it's spraying at that volume. See you later, Kurt. What? No, somebody's saying that they're leaving to go to Illinois. Oh. Uh, Lazy A Hole Ranch coat. is high, just watching, yeah. Easy on the first coat. You want to smoke it? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Kurt, I'm going to smoke it. Intake one, too. Yeah, everything. Anything that's exposed. Uh, go ahead and go ahead and paint it up. This paint smells Chinese. It is Chinese. Where's the word that you can do anything in the Yes, the shop door is open. We've got two doors open. One open there. And one open down here. We've got nice cross ventilation. No worries. Spray my face orange. <laughs> <laughs> it's almost Halloween. <laughs> yeah. Little Johnny J. Yes, I don't want to get paints on my camera, so I'm moving back. There's a lot of overspray. Yeah. Oh. You said you weren't using fram oil filters. Let's go. Good. He wants to set up this one also. Okay. I'm going to put this battery down. It's very heavy. So it's new stuff. All right. So you want to spin this thing up. Oh, you have an LG. What? You have an LG. A what? LG phone. What is that? LG. That's the brand. Oh, I thought she says L-O-G. I was like, <laughs> what? What? <laughs> My it's the paint the fumes. China. Made in China. Oh, Jesus. You see this? We're in trouble. Uh-oh. We're being redundant, everybody. What's that? Not for you. <laughs> <laughs> we are being redundant as far as the... Can, can I be honest with you? <laughs> like, this isn't something I think I even want to fuck really? with. It's so Korean. I mean, like, literally, man. It's a Chinese <laughs> condenser. It's like... Why do I have to use it? You just ask me if I have it. I mean, I guess this is this is an OE. Yeah, a, we can a, try that one first. Will it fit in here? It should, right? This is why we're doing two of them, because two is one, one is none. All right, so the, we, we're connecting the condenser out here, correct? Is that right? I think it's external. They have another set of valve covers. Yeah, but where does it. That are already painted. So those are just. You know, I mean, Spare valve cutters. Yeah. The black crinkle. Black crinkle, yeah. Where are they? Are they, they're not, are they back here? Yeah, they're right oh, okay. behind the tree. This? Uh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yep. See? You're there. They're there. 
That's a new one. Old shitty one. It's been sitting on the vice, it's not new anymore. Okay. So, this is. I'm trying to figure out where we're going to move. Where we're going to move. Awesome. That's all right. Is it, it clearly. Does this have see, the same length wire as that one? I don't really see how we're gonna, because we gotta go from here. We gotta go from here. That's what I like to say right now. <laughs> when he's ready. This is the coil wire. The wire goes to the coil. The, the condenser has to be close to the point. They can share it, but it's gotta be close. Kobe <laughs> sent five dollars. Someone please light that smoke for Uncle Tony. <laughs> Thank you. Somebody's looking out for me. <laughs> I don't know if you saw a lighter. I don't have one. Uh, Here, why don't we do this? Let's. You can look this up and figure out how to make that happen. I see it. And I will set this up to run. Well, oh, thank you. You're welcome. I'll set this up to run. Do we have your coil? Oh, Wayne Lemieux says, explain the relationship of that condenser, um, oops, sorry, of that condenser or capacitor, same difference? Same difference, right? Mm, I know. Coil or capacitor, same difference. It's the same thing. It, it's a, think of it as a shock absorber to the point. That's the condenser. The condenser. Yeah. The coil stores energy. Yeah. Well, no, the coil creates energy. Creates it. Magnetic yes. field collapses and it says zoom. Mm -hmm. Right? So we have this black, this was a, oh, what was that? This is what we got for the MSP box. That doesn't require, this is the setup for your point ignition. Blaster for coil or points. Okay. So does that come with a ballast resistor in it? It, well, it doesn't, no, it, it itself does not, but I have a new ballast resistor. Okay, now. It, it does not need a different <coughs> We have one thing that I'm not sure how we're going to do this. The, my old battery charger mm -hmm. is gone to the ship. Yes, I have I a 12 volt a new one. battery charger. Okay. I have a 12 volt. I have a 12 volt battery charger too, but it only goes on when it senses battery load. Have a 12 volt okay, good. Okay, oh, okay that'll work. Um, Try to think about it. Easy, boys, easy. Let it, let it check out. Russell, Russell Finch says Tony energized the capacitor and handed it to Austin. <laughs> uh, no, I'm going to do it. Yeah, give me a fifth. Give me what? No, I told you that's all. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know which coil you want to still like this whole thing block to be done. It really should be the same. Yeah. Right? See there you go. Yeah. And what coil? That was beautiful. See what? Wait, still. I mean, I oh no, you have a lot of I don't need that. Going to be so we're gonna chuck this up. You say it's a joke, but it might actually be popular. <gasps> it's getting a little messy in here. I can't try and predict what the internet wants anymore. I'm just trying to get this. Everything got weird. Something something. Yeah. Now you're fine. You gotta clean up a little bit. Well, I mean, I can only do so much. <laughs> I know. We, like, we need somebody to run around and clean up and grab stuff. What do we need clean up? We'll, we'll, we'll police everything in the Throw stuff in the garbage. Uh, oh, did someone bring the loaf of bread? Did somebody bring did a loaf? Did someone win the bread? No, nobody won the bread. Oh. Just the mustard and you the have, You have ketchup. all the hot dogs? 
Yeah, they're in the fridge. You want to make a few hot dogs? You can't because you got to work. Yeah, <laughs> I can't. <laughs> I can barbecue and do the camera at the same time. Yeah, a long day. Do I, okay, do you want me to light the grill? They'll just come with me to light the grill. <laughs> I mean, it's actually warm. I could probably just. Am I the only coals. one who's gonna eat? I don't know. Ask them. Don't don't cook if I'm the only one who's gonna eat. Um, this is gonna be constant. I am. Right? Mm, I don't need anything. Order a three foot hero then. <laughs> uh, this isn't this isn't New York. We don't have three foot heroes here. Yeah, we don't have them. Right there, you can probably just um, hook it on the top on the backside, maybe. Yeah. No, Tony, your diet. Oh. <laughs> They're telling you not to eat. I know. Huh? <laughs> right. Where's my drill? Aw, you can eat, Tony. No, I'm not going to eat. Where's my drill? It's right. these guys we drill moving down stuck. to the open a hero shop. Right there with the hone. Oh, right there. That is a heavy battery. Oof. Yeah, that's the downside. Though. Yeah. Carry that around in your pocket is. Bit much. Got a black Sharpie, so we can write frame on this. <laughs> oh, my. All right, Sid wants to know, Andy, are you having a good time? I am having a pretty good time, yes. But cool. it's what's work. We need uh, the coil. So you don't burn your points? You don't burn the points? Yeah, I don't know. Where is the pizza? Do we just order pizza? There's nobody going to deliver out here. Why? Why would they deliver out here? People live out here. Do we need the, do we need the ballast resistor? Yes. Right now? Oh, you're doing the server test? Yeah. Still on the... Uh, on the drill. Yeah. Let's see. Okay, I have to watch this. All right, let me grab the battery. Yeah, there's I mean, really not much to watch yet. Okay. <sighs> Tony, you want food? I'll get you food. No, I mean, we, we really don't have much more to do tonight. No? no. You sure? Positive. There, I was told to give you that. Thank you. Just get out of the way. That is straight gray. Yep. Do you have low blood sugar, Tony? Oh no. <laughs> this looks cherry. Oh, There's nothing to watch at, eh? It looks cherry. Alright. Oh my goodness. This looks confusing. So old technology here. Oh, very nice. Measures the dwell. Very cool. So, this we're gonna hook some negative. See, this is something you can't do on a modern car. You can't just take the entire ignition system and set it up on a vise and test it. Oh, good. You got check jumper? the oh, paint coat on the orange. Why? Does it look light? Hmm? Hmm? Does the orange look light? It looks good. It's a little light. These only these go this far. All right, so let's move things out of the way. Boy, this is this is a bag of confusion. Is that Hemi orange or Alice Chalmers orange? <laughs> Alice it is Hemi orange. I I thought about making it. 
Yeah, but you do realize there are two hemi yeah, oranges. Yeah, that looks a little light. There's race hemi orange, mm. which is pale, and there's three hemi orange. That's pale. What does the can say on it? Orange. Orange. Orange engine paint. That's it? Well, that's close enough. Orange engine paint, Hemi Orange. OER code okay, 2007. Okay, a little length of jumper wire to go from the balance to look through. Well, let's see this one. Okay, well, Oh, never mind, never mind, never mind. I could just attach the ballast resistor directly to the coil. Oh. John. Okay, and our dwell meter wants to hook to positive, negative. And you hooking that to the mustard, Tony? Huh? <laughs> you hooking that to the mustard? Yes. <laughs> That's what it looks like. <laughs> okay, we'll just rest that right there. And we'll hook this right here. Wait a minute, that Chevy orange. Mm. Mm. Oops. Need another one. Alright, wait. Let's hook this. Let's hook this to the distributor. Let's hook. Yeah. Well, it was at one point. Mustard is an important diagnostic tool. Yeah. <laughs> It can be. It can be. <laughs> you got a coil wire? Maybe. Here's the dwell meter. How do you turn this thing off? This right here. Okay. Here's the gauge. Here's the gauge. Not yet. Let's, let's make sure we got. Do you need a wire to go? Just like, yeah, coil, like coil wire. Okay. Austin, your punishment for uh, not showing up early this morning is to hold those wires. Got it. All right, where are they at? <laughs> yeah, I really want 50,000 <laughs> volts. Yeah, I really want that. <laughs> What are you kidding about, Charlotte? Um, I was looking away, actually. I don't know. Oh, you've had the same analyzer for 40 years, so. <laughs> okay, something ain't right. Okay. It's the mustard. The hell with the ballast resistor. Oh. Good, you sure this is? Why did it take so long for that to... Maybe it was this. Gotta get the core. Okay. So... Austin. Yep. Yeah, come here. What? Hold this to the ground. Okay. Hang on. I don't want you to do that. Yeah, don't do that. All right, I need a piece of paper. How thick? A piece of paper. That's not okay. <laughs> Okay. Here's thicker. That's all right, this will work. Here's fine. I don't like that. That's... All right, so now you hook up your dwell meter. Okay. Is that Carmen San Diego in the background? Yes, yeah. it is her. We found her. Yeah. <laughs> Positive, negative. Hook it through the uh, the negative. Sure. The lead or the. Oh wait. Okay, you can do one of those. So you should be able to just hook the black to right here. And positive. You shouldn't need that. Let me see. Okay. 
is like a Chinese fire drill. <laughs> okay, ready? Uh, did, did I get you? What do we got? 35. 30, 34, 35. Okay. So, seems, seems a little I, I, need another, yeah, I need another piece of paper. Right here. Okay. That's so. high for one individual point. That's right. We're going to do one at a time. Why is she still showing? She saw them both. <laughs> That's, this is going to, this is going to spark her. Uh, I don't know. Twenty-six. Okay. Let's open. Let's open this one in here. I need glasses. Uh, oh, wait, 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 wait. This is Horsepower TV in 1969. Okay. 31. Close enough. I can feel the electricity moving through this cable. Yeah, you can. <laughs> yeah. Mm. 27. 28. All right, we got a we got a problem here, man. These. Right. Yeah. These. There's way too much feedback. All right, so let's take this off of here. Let's go through the ballast resistor. Way too much feedback. John Wilburn sent $6.11. Thank you, John. Ground strap for Austin's ankle. Yep. <laughs> Need that. Ready? Yep. 28. 35. 28. Uh -huh. 28. 41? Yeah. Alright, one more time. Let's check it one more time.
I have no idea what's going on. Oh, the coal was smoking earlier. Pretty. I mean, it's sparking, which means that we're grounded here. Weak coil? No, I don't think so. I would. We got that super coil, that $20 yeah, super coil. Yeah, throw another coil in there. I think the grid is going down. <laughs> I think the grid is going down. Uh, Joseph says condenser. So it says condenser. Um, is that a brand new coil? Yes. Yeah, that's definitely making a... Get a volt meter on there. That test line, right? I got it. That's not even hot. All right. Hang on. Let me throw this trash. Boy, is electronic ignition nice. Thanks for the words of encouragement. Yeah, thank you. We appreciate that. <laughs> and honestly, this gap is too small to have given that reading. Well, the 41 was after it lost juice. It's pegged at 41. It's pegged at 41 right now. It's just sitting at 41. Yeah, I was trying to get these angles to hit all the Test light time. What are you looking at? Well, I mean, we should have grounded to the body. Here, check, yeah, check here. <laughs> so volts. Four volts. No, I mean, uh, volts DC, 7.9. We shouldn't have anything on that side. Here, go back to that. I mean, this makes my sense. Other than these, these gaps are like way too small to. Okay, I think I think there's something wrong with your dwell meter. Yeah, that's what it is. Yep. I feel it coming through now. Yep. Dwell meter. Dwell meter's not hooked up somewhere. Well, I think there's something wrong with your dwell meter. Because I literally had to close these points to like nothing to get the reading that you wanted. Well, I wouldn't doubt it. It's old as hell. Let's go back to, uh, let's set them manually again. You got the fuel gauge? Oh, the fumes are gone. We got another. You got your dwell meter here? Yeah, it's in my trunk. Yeah, let's, yeah try get it. It. let's try it. I will go get it for you. Thank you. So I'm going to up the are, you, are you sure you're looking at you were looking at the right scale? I believe eight cylinder dwell. Dwell. High RPM. I have no idea what you're talking about. Oh, this one. Yeah? It's, 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 <laughs> This one? Yeah, I think it's this one. Everybody else puts shit in there. No, not me. I think that's mine on the table, though. Right there? Yeah. Yeah, yeah I didn't. I drink my coffee black. Alright. Nice. Yeah, that one's mine. I have mine in my hand. A baby sip out of it. I had to move my little. Okay. Your little lip thing there. So, you got it hooked up again? No, not yet. Austin went to get his. Alright. 
Well, let's just see. So right now it's giving a reading. I think. Well, yeah. well how's it giving a reading when the green isn't hooked up? It's, it's just reading. Where is it's just green? reading bolts. This is the, just the greatest clusterfuck. Because the table has Mountain Dew on it. Apparently that spark will bring Frank and Garrett back from the desk. Exactly. <laughs> yes. 34. This actual expedition. 34. Oh. Hold on, wait a minute. Yeah, I'm reading the right thing. There's something wrong here. Like right, I'm gonna I'm gonna ground this, I'm gonna block this set and let's watch this set. Ready? Yes. Twenty seven. Saying it's the rig. No, we're grounded directly to the body. We got a different uh here. Alright, tell me what we got now. Okay. 27. Say what? Austin's metaphysical energy is shorting out the dollar. Jonathan Couchy <laughs> sent five dollars. Thanks, John. Green burn will set at thirty-five no matter the rotation of the distributor or you have to do control of the of the connected. Twenty three. Hey, Kathy, tell Tony to try setting the first set to 17 and the second to 19. Already done that. Yeah, Already now did we're it. trying to do it on a, on a meter. Yeah, mm -hmm. This whole thing can be... Thank you, Doug Norton. Hold on, I lost the power position. Oh. What? Ready? Uh, you got the thing. Okay. I'm hooked up. I'm gonna All block right. off one set. Hold on, dwell. Okay, got it. No, where am I at? Dwell. Eight cycle. Okay. Ready? Yep. Twenty-seven. Okay. Twenty five. Twenty five. Thirty six. Thirty seven. Thirty six. Thirty six. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna work with this set. That engine looks beautiful. It does. Okay, ready? Ready. It's gonna look great with the crinkle black. Twenty four, twenty one, twenty, thirty, thirty one, thirty one, two, thirty one. Okay. This side. Twenty-five. Oh, thirty. Oh, Twenty-nine. Oh, oh, something happened. Went all the way up to forty. About forty. Yeah, pull the pull the wire up. Got it. Oh, the plug it. All right, so there you go. So hit it now. 40. 40? All right, we're coming. Oh, look at that spark. All right, let me just lock these down, all right? Make sure it doesn't move. That's locked down. That's locked down. 40, 41. That is perfection. Got a beautiful purple spark. Right? Yep. 
Oh, yeah. I didn't so get to see it on what's camera. What's up with that coil? Oh, here, show them the, here, show them the spark. Yeah. I'm not touching it. Ah, uh, yeah, okay. I'll, I'll do it right here. Okay. Send it. Hey, Sabrina, come grab this. Oh, yeah. Now, what was up with that other coil, you think? I have no idea, man. We try it again. It did no? get kind of smoky. You know? It got really hot. Well, it did get hot. really hot. Yeah. It might have been sitting on this a point. <laughs> it might have no. been sitting when the points were closed and overcharged the oil. No, not 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 to that extent. Not it's still like, not like yeah. leaving your yeah. key on or not for that amount of time. No, it should have. Yeah. It should have left that off. Oh, that's just like warm. warm. Yeah. Let me right. see that. This is like almost. Sounds stupid, but yes, that's pretty hot. Yeah, we fit it through a ballast and everything. So let's, just for shits and giggles, let's swap it over. Uh, ask Tony what the gaps are now. I don't know. <laughs> you don't know? <laughs> They're what, whatever they want to achieve 40 degrees. Mm -hmm. And just watch the engine paint dry. All night. <laughs> and then when uh, Andy and I get up in the middle of the night, you pee. Yeah. Okay, it is that. And then walk away. <laughs> yeah, well, Balfour Sisters got just some temperature to it. Right Where's the, uh, hold on. Here, man. Hold on. Oh. Oh, yeah. Where can I hold this? Oh, 100 bucks if you hold it in your teeth. <laughs> All right, man. <laughs> That's hot, huh? Yeah, it's hot. That's right. Ready? Okay. Right. Hold on. Well, I'm not getting anything. It's not because it's not hooked up. Okay, ready? Uh, Tony Jonathan Couch, you sent five dollars. Thank you, John. Uh, hey, Tony, has anyone done a low deck 361 Hemi build? 361 Hemi? Mm. You, mean, you mean 354? Oh. I don't know. Yeah. Uh, well, what is it? Oh, no, no, this wasn't negative. No, this, yeah, this uh, goes to the negative on the coil, and this just goes to power. Polybun says that's a bad spark compared to the other coil I was making. Mind, right. it's, it's, it's a what? That's a bad spark compared to the thin blue spark the other coil He's was she, Yeah, they're yes, right. Yes, we agree. Yeah. All right, so our brand new blaster coil right out of the package is junk. Can we hook up the $20 XL super coil? <laughs> yeah, let's hook up the $20 XL super coil. We'll figure out this is good. We got the wick. Bonus, so twenty bucks. Stick it on there. Nice. Yeah. Is this the Halloween special now? <laughs> All right. So let's see what the twenty dollars super coil does. Yep. I love these fucking things. They're so big and so yellow and so obnoxious. Long day, boys. True life build day. It is Great a long job. day. I gotta set up this other. Do you think that's right, Austin? I mean, this is negative. This is yeah, yeah, no, that's right. I just, okay. I, you know, I spaced out for a second. I'm used to seeing it in my car, so. Oh, so I don't, I don't know if this is gonna work. I don't know if you need to buy this. Huh? Camera it, it should have focus. one. Is it? Sucking down this coffee. Here, it's hold. Crazy. It's hot. It's hot. Hold on. Hold on. Let me get it. What's up, old car guy? 
Is it clear now? I mean, there hasn't been any change. What are you hooking up? Don't Ready? Need. Ready? Oh, hold on. Yep. You don't need a drum meter on No, that. we don't need it. It's already set. Wow, okay. Yeah. Right. Yeah, I got it, yeah. Right. That's hot. Listen, Jake, and she got it. <laughs> Sorry, I'll No, you're good, you're good. Uh, let me get this question. Jay Russell way. Finch. Right. Ready? Okay. <laughs> See, ah. those, those fucking coils oh, are awesome. <laughs> Close to the ground. Well, it was trying to shock me through the insulation. That's the best 20 bucks you'll ever spend. It was hot, man. <laughs> yeah, oh, That's the best, the best 20, 20, 20 bucks you'll ever spend. Hot coil. Hey, the super coil works. Excellent. Ask me how All I right, know. Now we got to do this with the mallard. Is it electrifying? Yeah, it's shockingly good. It's shockingly good. It's shockingly good. It's, it's shockingly worth $20. Yeah, $20. Uh, Right. Get the set up for okay. So, but right now we got a distributor we can drop in to go. We do. How awesome is that? What next? Watch paint dry. Yeah, so the paint live stream. Well, I got to I got to set the Mallory up so I have a redundant yeah, this. system. This thing looks gorgeous. Let's check the paint. <sighs> Who's the Picasso? Fucking John and I. Oh, yeah. Mark. yeah. It's like the, the trio. The trio, right? Yep. Yeah. Got John, you went on. You went on thermostat. Yeah, yeah, John. Oh, I just kind of watched to see if it's if there's any thin spots with the light and then keep going. Yeah, mm -hmm. Saving up for the. Alice Chalmers orange would look better. It would have. But you didn't give us that. You gave us Henny orange. Oh, oh see, this devalues the car like 20 cents. How are we lifting it? You're saying that's Hemi Race Orange. There, it's Race Hemi Orange. It does look like Race Hemi it Orange. It does, it's lighter. Yes. Yeah. Well, good, it's a race car. There you go. Problem solved. Getting it in. Well, we need to figure that out. How are we lifting this? Thank you, Bad Tree Productions. You guys do what? Strap it under the water pump. No. Yeah. No. I think it's the Dave Karras Shoe sent nineteen ninety nine because this show is the best Thank and you all are bad mama jammers. But to be you want me I'm be perfectly you. honest with you. I never put them in complete. I know. I put the block in, I put the short block together, I put the I put it and then I do everything else with it inside the car. So I really have no idea how you want to lift this fucking thing up. And then lift it by the intake? Or no, no, it's because it's all center. No, 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 Thank you, Pirate Greg. This great show I've been watching since this morning. Wow. Wow, what a trooper. What a trooper. <laughs> yeah, yeah what a thank trooper. you. <laughs> I lost interest hours ago. Yeah, right. <laughs> No, no, no. The, the 67s don't go. Oh, they don't have them? All right. It's drilled for it. So this is... It's an engineering feat. Well, I mean, the, I, the, 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 simple, the simple one is just here to here, the chain, yep. right? Uh, and we'll have enough hands to manhandle it however it's going to yeah, go. like tonight. But that's not the optimum way to do this. And like I said, to me, this is something, like, I don't do this. I put the block in, you know what I mean, and then I, I do everything else around it. Mm -hmm. oh, I have no idea how we're going to... We did the... We did the poly by the, by the intake, and it's about the same size. But I guarantee they don't heavier. weigh the same. The poly, this, this is a hundred and something pounds heavier yeah, than the poly. poly. John Wilburn says you could spin eyeballs into the block and lift from the eyes. 
Oh yeah, no, we can, that's that's not a problem. We can we can we can chain it. John Greenwald sent twenty dollars. Thank, Thank you, you for being you. So with the flyweight. Thank, Thank you, you John. Thank you. We appreciate that. Yeah, I think there's a couple ways to do it. I think we could do an apex here and the front. Mm -hmm. And then and have us in four links. Um, instead of just going there. Put it in from the bottom like the factory. Oh, the K-frame's there. Yeah, that's it's something we don't really so. want. <laughs> yeah, no, well, the question is, if you had two links, you could cross over and then cross over again. It would pretty much self-sign. Well, like, what about, like, like, like boom, boom, I mean, here, yeah. that's, and then boom, boom back there, and then link the two, and mm -hmm. then... The yeah, engine looks we amazing. Yeah, we do want to watch the aluminum intake. Put the yeah, motor yeah, mounts yeah, and K-frame straps off the K-frame to the hoist. The would be like right here, and then you ain't got no room. Put the motor mounts and K-frame straps off the K-frame to the hoist. Yeah, yeah. So without the valve covers on, yes. Mm -hmm. That would get it up, but I don't know if it would. Be Nylon up. straps at motor mounts. So what's the end goal tonight? Yeah. What's the end goal? We've met our goal actually, which was to have it painted. Yeah. Okay. So we are now. Hold on. We are now. So we've got it painted, and we have our emissions sorted out too. Which is so now it's a matter so of we know rain. This thing should just. We know now it should fire. It should fire right up. Oh, yeah. uh, nylon straps through a large steel round hog ring. <laughs> I'm going to leave it to these guys to figure out. Okay. We want to put it in with the flywheel clutch bell housing starter. The guy had a pretty good idea of the, of the motor mounts, strapped from the motor mounts. Yeah, the motor mount. Here's the thing you have to keep in mind when we're doing this now, right? Yeah. The angle, when we go to plug the transmission, <laughs> the angle has to be exactly right oh, hey, or it's not going to be So let's say you hang it from sling. You make, you make a, a, a sling area. If, if the transmission is, is like this, this and the engine is like this, or like this, it's not going to be Because uh, you'll, you'll, be you'll be able to get it to spline, but you won't get the pilot to the bushing. So it has to be exact. That is plan A. Plan B is maybe an extra, an extra step, but not that big of a deal. Drop the training. Drop the training. Plug the training is not that big of Because we have enough people to we'll just man handle it. Or put, yeah. plug the tiny yeah. post engine in. Just paint my mouth. Just lay them on your back. It's easier to just. You know, up here. Because it weighs a billion pounds. It's extra 160 pounds. Yeah, I got to bed if somebody could use you. Yeah, we'll plug it in on the other side. Well, Rose Garage says to put car plates in a short chain between the two and lift her. I stole one once out of a 67 RT that was on the side of a housing project. Mm -hmm. <laughs> is the is the uh, statute of limitations gone from that? Well, the car was like it was on the side of the housing project. They had no plates. It was like it was obviously it's abandoned. Know, abandoned. So it was during the winter. And how old were you? Seventeen. Okay, so you were juvenile. Sixteen, seventeen. Okay. I don't know. <laughs> But I, I got a, I got one of them little last garden. week. <laughs> no, <laughs> last week. A couple hours ago. I got one of those garden. I didn't go for coffee. What do you call right. little garden shovel? Probably <laughs> trowel. Trowel. Like well, okay, yeah. <laughs> garden, <laughs> little garden shovel. Ray Aldo sent you ten dollars. I thought you get a trench. Thank you, Ray. Under the car. Oh really? Yeah. With the garden trowel, right? And I got everything on, you know, disconnected and everything, and it pulled the transmission out and, and got it. Out. That's awesome. <laughs> it was in the middle of the winter, too. I was like, I'll never forget that. It was like 10 degrees. Kids are watching. <laughs> it was 10 degrees. I said, kids that's are not, watching. I know. That's not. <laughs> I know, but you tell a story about it. I was a kid. <laughs> All right. I was a kid. <laughs> okay. I, I might have I done a couple of things that weren't like completely in the up and up. Okay. <laughs> I was a kid. I may have. May have. Man. See, you should have gone into the military. They wouldn't have me. I'd be in the, what do you call it? The brig? The brig. The brig. Yeah. Nothing. They'd have me hanging from the gun. Mark, can you uh, look at Mallory? Whatever it is. No, they weren't. Looks, like looks like Uncle Tony's sitting at a swap meet table. 
Uh, stockade, Joseph Giannini says. Stockade. 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 Yeah, we don't have those hardly anymore. No, yeah. hardly? They make it for me. Can still go to Leavenworth though. <laughs> Leavenworth, which is a nice place. Is it? Yeah. Well, the the non-jail side. Yeah, well, so, yeah so. the non-jail side. Okay, so now, oh, I missed the super chat. Okay, sorry, I was taking a sip of coffee. Hang on. Somebody sent a I'm looking. Ray Alba, yes, $10. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you. Thank you. So, <sighs> all right, so, I think we're pretty much wound down here now. Okay. Yeah. Um, tomorrow, the motor goes in. Tony's sitting high because he's on a... Yeah, I'm on, a, I'm on a on a stool. He's on yeah. the big boy stool. The big boy stool. The they big let me, chair. They let me on the big boy stool now. At the adults table. <laughs> so t tomorrow morning, we'll be back here, eight o'clock. John, does it work for you? Sure. <coughs> Want to get up early? Austin, does that work for you? Yes, that works for me. Okay. okay. <laughs> I didn't know what time I needed to be here, so we'll be here. I can fill in again. Yeah. I won't. So tomorrow morning we'll be here at eight o'clock. Um, and you guys, you guys actually, what you should do is come to work on the jet too. Say what? You can work on the jet too. Yeah. Kathy will be here. She'll be. She can help run the, run all of this stuff. Yeah, we want to get the K-frame. What we're, am I running? We got your extra hands for for doing all of this. And in the meantime, we get stuff done with the jet too. Yeah. So we'll kill two birds at one stone tomorrow. What am I yeah, running? Two birds stoned at once. The uh, the, the, this, this. Oh oh yeah. oh. Okay. This. <laughs> All of this splendor. All of this. <laughs> and uh, I'm going to say, if, if, if you're planning for tomorrow, I am going to say the motor should be plugged. If we start at 8, motor should be plugged in by about 11 or 12. We should be able to fire it by 2. Thereabouts. 2 or 3. So, no, yeah, sounds about right. Yeah, I think all we need is a uh, battery. We got fuel. The carburetors worked previously. Yeah. We rebuilt them. Right. Which means they won't work now. We'll fill them out. with gas just to make sure. Um, and the distributors good that then we let it run. Break it in, or we gotta switch the springs out. Right. Just leave. Just leave the fucking <laughs> Trust me, you'll never miss those in it. With that cam and, and the R cam you're gonna come but it'll be like um, all right, so that's it. All right, we're going to sign up? Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah. yeah. So I, I just want to say formally in front of our audience, we appreciate each and every one of you, you guys. Really, this was a great day of work. We got a lot of stuff done. Everything was smooth. Everything was like just cooperative and, and flowed, you know? Thank you all. We need more drama. <laughs> so tomorrow, how drama? We'll have drama tomorrow. Yeah, we can't have <laughs> drama. Tomorrow, maybe a bit of crooked rocker arm. There's all kinds of drama. That was the only thing there was, wasn't there? That crooked rocker arm? Um, yeah, and we the had coil. something else. Yeah, yeah. lash caps were, were yeah, lash messing caps with were screwing us. Yeah. yeah. Hmm. The oil seals. Oh. Yeah, oil seals. We didn't copper coat anything. We didn't cut that. Whoever that, that guy, the copper coat guy, is going to be all like. That guy must have stock in that company. I think that when we try to start it without copper coat, it's just going to explode. Like, How could it not? I mean, we must have the beast. Suddenly. Okay, here it is. All right, so you're going to do the live stream of paint drying? Yeah. yeah. You doing that? I could. I'm going to put it on. You going to set it up? <laughs> if you do it, I'm, 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 I'm going to sign up right now. Okay. Have to sign out of this one. So that right. Can, yeah. As soon as we out. sign out of this one, we'll put up another live stream of the motor drying overnight. Paint drying. Right. Okay. Live paint drying extravaganza. <laughs> so, I'll set it up on that then. <laughs> okay. Did you just move that head over to the other side? Thank you, everybody, for coming and hanging out, commenting. We gotta clean up. Look at this mess. Holy cow. Oh, it's just coffee. <laughs> and <laughs> yeah, lots of garbage. That's right. We'll get it all cleaned up. The prizes. Yeah, the prize must. The prizes. Yeah. Catch up and melt I gotta mail that out. Are you really gonna mail it? Of course, of course. I am. <laughs> he won fair and square. Yep.
They both got it. What a mess. Yep. Are you really having contests for condiment? Yeah. Yeah, yeah there were yeah. there were trivia questions to win. You gotta see some of this ketchup stuff. and mustard. <laughs> we used to send out <coughs> half bags of chips. <laughs> you sent to me like like noodles that were already cooked. Oh, I mean, you name it. We need to send out Garrett's ashes. Garrett's no. ashes. <laughs> we used to send out slices of pizza. Yeah. We sent um, Parmesan cheese. Yeah, well, <laughs> God, this gonna be awful when it gets there. Half used Parmesan cheese. It's gonna be awful. <laughs> they don't care as long as they get their fries. They don't care. Oh, I got some cheese from Uncle Tony. <laughs> how does Andy feel? Andy, they want to know how you feel. Feel good. You feel good? Yeah. Okay. Good. It's a good day of work. I'm mm -hmm. happy to get the motor assembled, and I think it's uh, going to run just fine. Okay. Awesome. Well, He's happy, everybody. All right. Uh, you going to give a sticker with my ketchup? Okay. Don't be greedy. <laughs> <laughs> He's still here? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Tony's setting up the live stream of the motor. Drawing. You trying? Drying, but I, I I'm can't. Of the motor drying, yeah. All I right. I can't go to set up the thing. You sign out of that. Okay, all right. I'm signing out, guys. Everybody say good night. Good night, guys. Thank you, everybody. What? Good night, everybody. Thank you. Good night. Get it? There it is. I'm signing out. Do you want?